Yeah, I've got a scheme today. Yeah, I've got schemes. I got ideas. I, uh, I was playing in my own separate game, which was going very well today, until, uh, a giant parakeet the size of a house decided I was done playing that day. It was going well until then. It was going well until a giant parakeet was like, what's up? What's up? You got a whole base down there, huh? I'm coming in with my friends. And because they also had two other parakeet friends, uh, they all came into my house and then uh, fucking killed everyone I knew. <laughs> Look, chat. Here's what I'm thinking. Okay? I think, and this might sound a little crazy, I think currently that my current base that we had last session is beans. It was kind of like, it was kind of like the warm up. There was a lot of silly things I did in there that just really didn't work out. And frankly, you can't add mods post into a game. And there's some quality of life stuff I kind of want in my game that have already been added to the workshop. I think we might do a new one. I think we might just do a new one because I also think I could make this place a lot more unlivable. And I do kind of want that. I really want to kind of ride the line between these dwarves uh, being happy and not realizing that they truly live in hell. I think I can do better. So I think I'm gonna try- I think we're gonna do a new one. Uh, probably same world. no, not same world. I think I need to do a new world because I downloaded a mod that gets rid of aquifers because I think they're fucking annoying. <laughs> a couple dwarf fortresses in now of like testing around. I think they're fucking annoying and honestly, I can't stand- it wouldn't bother me if it wasn't that I had to constantly reconfirm for my game uh, that they need to dig through them. It's there's a there's hundreds of elevation. I just really can't stand this game fucking telling me eighteen thousand times that there's damp rocks beneath us and therefore we cannot dig. I just I just can't. I can't I can't live like that. Do a volcano fortress. I'm not scared of lava. All right, no one's- I'm not scared of magma. No one I know is. I'm not scared of that. I'm a dwarf, I don't fucking care. But yeah, obviously, uh... I will certainly- I've got new- I've got new ideas and new- new approaches. Most of- here's the problem. Almost all of my base, the issues around my base, started at the aquifer. <laughs> and they never got better. And honestly, I just don't think I can- I just don't think- and plus I fucked up the farming thing, and then farming got fucked, and then the zoning got fucked, and the stockpiles got fucked because everything else got fucked. I'm- I- I think it's just a better- I think we'd actually just progress faster back to where we were if I just started from scratch. <laughs> Cause I really didn't get that far in the grand scheme, but this time I- I am much- I think the giant bad alligator were your downfall? No. No, 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 no. Matter of fact, I would say we handled those quite well. Only one guy lost his arm fighting those. The giant bat was bad. But yeah, no, we also, I didn't have goods made in time. There was no one like making goods to sell to the fucking merchants. We just whiffed it. We whiffed a lot of stuff. You had a legendary weaponsmith and armor. Once I'm given something that's the best ever, I lose interest in it almost immediately. Uh, I, I, the, nothing about those two keeps me attached to the old base. It really doesn't. I do not care about that. Nothing, nothing about the legendary armor and weaponsmiths makes me care about them. I don't care. It's the, it's the journey to me. And considering I got them both on a whim, like it was nothing, I'd rather get my legendaries out of making, like, the strange mood shit. Not through just having someone move into my house. Anyways, so. Yeah. He just wants that pathetic POV. I can make it so much more pathetic. I've really, 
I, I definitely am not gonna do individualized rooms this time. This time I'm gonna pack them all into a big old box like sardines. That's one thing I know for sure. This time they're getting packed into a big old box. Like a bunch of sardines. We're doing barracks. I'm done with this. They're getting barracks. They're getting barracks and the people with with real jobs, okay, can have the real rooms. Okay? Okay. I'm just done dealing with this bullshit. Manager entombed in his office. See, I just want like a necromancer to join my colony so I can entomb him. I can give him a management job and then entomb him in his own room so he can never leave because he doesn't have to eat or drink and he can't die. That's the plan. I mean, if I ever get a guy that's immortal, first time I do is seal them in their own room and just force them to do logistics for the rest of their life. That's my plan. But he can reanimate hair. Don't care. Don't care, none of that matters. All right, I, but I do know the things that do matter that I did skip last time. This time, dwarves are gonna have burrows. We're not dealing with this shit anymore. I don't wanna see my dwarf out getting eaten by parakeets 100 miles from the fucking building. I'm done with that. There's so many things that I skipped doing partially because I didn't care or I didn't think it would matter and I know it does and it did. And now that one of my forts has been truly dismantled by the uh, efforts of one parakeet, I'm done. I will not be pushed around anymore. He finally cares about us dwarves. Did you not have dwarves? I did, or so I believed, at the time. I'm not sure if a dwarf was like, oh cool, welcome, and just like opened the door for them to let them in, but that's what it kind of seemed like. Because by the time I realized that parakeet had gotten in, uh, they were in. It was a little too late to adjust. The parakeet had strangled most of the people in town. Look, this is gonna be, it's gonna be fine. This time things are gonna be different. I'm gonna definitely design this place a lot more streamlined and more specifically, a lot more dense. Okay, we're gonna really, you see, there's a lot of stuff that I would say I didn't zone well. We can definitely, there's a lot, there's, there's no aquifers is big. I, I'm gonna be happy to see them gone. I don't know what else to say. I'm gonna be really happy to see them gone. You're gonna put a hospital in this time? No. Let's slow the fuck down! Okay? A lot of people are saying a lot of things. Tch, healthcare? People who get mangled by, like, alligators and stuff get put in logistics jobs, and if they can't do them, they get put in the fucking ground. Alright? Okay? That's what's happening out here. That's what happens. Overseer, I broke my toe. You better not have. Better not have. That would be not good for you. That would be bad for you. That'd be really bad.
we definitely need to we definitely need to make sure and I've actually got a thing open I've got the actual dwarf fortress wiki open this time we need to make sure that I get the garbage dump set up properly this time we cannot have these dwarves not dumping the garbage the gar there's just there was so many rocks last time the rocks got uh, really out of hand really quickly Lots of rocks. Gonna have to get that, that shit dumped this time. But yeah. But I did... I don't know if this Wikipedia page is accurate. But apparently a dump tile can infinitely compress items. As in, if you say something's garbage, the game can- the game will just be like, Okay, well, uh, a billion rocks can fit in this dumpster. So that's cool. Uh, we're definitely gonna take advantage of quantum stockpiles. Cuz I- I really definitely do not want all those rocks. We're gonna take advantage of the quantum stockpile. Rune magic. Man, I just want a big old pit of lava we can use to hook all of our garbage into. Like, I just want, I just want. I just, I just want to know that my guys ran, like, are running up to a big old po pool of lava and hucking dead bodies into it. That's all. Did you add the dicks mod? No, I didn't add the fucking dicks mod. Why not, though? Dude, I was too busy adding the gorilla milking mod. The doy. <laughs> I was too busy adding the mod that lets me milk gorillas. <laughs> I would call it the most important mod. You guys don't understand. That's your problem. That's your problem. Is that you're fucking you're freaking dumb. It's like, I would actually call it the most important thing ever. I feel sick. Dude, nothing like a bit of, nothing like a bit of, a bit of gorilla milk. You know what I mean? Nothing like a bit of, a bit of that, a bit of that good good. Nice ice cold glass. We call it gilk. <laughs> Shut the f Ew! I hate that! I- I hate it! According to the mod, the actual name of it is Jungle Juice. According to the mod, it's Jungle Juice. All right. <laughs> That's worse. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to fucking tell you. Other than it's subscribed on my workshop. Okay. Oh yeah, we're probably not gonna spend too much time in the in the intro today, cause frankly, uh, we're starting from scratch, so I got a bit of work to do. 
You gotta be at work to do this time. I'm probably gonna carefully. No, I don't think I need to be careful. <laughs> I definitely don't need to be careful, dude. I can just wing it twice, bro. No need, dude. Carefulness is for you losers. I'd care in RimWorld where my character, there's only three of my guys and they're all fucking idiots, but in Dwarf Fortress, boy oh boy, you gotta do quite a bit for me to even remember your name. Out here in Dwarf Fortress, you really, you really gotta fucking sell yourself out here for me to even understand who the hell you are. Tomato Selwyn got an economy update. I don't think I can do that anytime soon. You let me know when the economy doesn't require me to do 500 back and forth trips across the same two islands in order to have enough money to like buy a like functional compass. Okay. You let me know when the economy has that. You let me know when I can get a compass in my game. Okay. Someone doesn't sound like a happy bear. You start with a compass now. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean compass. I meant chrono compass. The one that lets me actually navigate the real map instead of the fucking baby boy weenie hut junior zones. The compass for dorks? Because, uh, yeah. I also, I'll be more interested when they also add, like, some more, like, another archipelago. Something else in, like, the middle. A little bit of something else. Maybe some unmarked islands with treasure on them. Something cool. Something, something cool that adds a little bit of variety to the, uh, travel time. I hope he embarks in an evil biome with zombies. My guy, my people, can barely remember to throw out normal garbage waste. I can't handle it when I know my garbage waste will also come alive and try to strangle my guys. Like, I really just can't deal with that yet. I'm not doing that in a million billion years. I'm not doing that. How are they supposed to beat the nervous system of, like, a creature they killed five hours ago? Oh, yeah. Never even used all those horse nerves. Alright, what do you make out of horse nerve, chat? What do you make out of horse nerve? Nerve juice. I'm not seeing much that's talking about uh, nerves as like something you can actually use for crafting. You can use nerves as medical sutures. Oh, well, that's why I don't know about it. I didn't actually invest in any medicine for my dwarves, which is why one of them whom got their hand a little bit bit got sealed in a tomb. <laughs> I'm really, dude, I, I, dude, I'm just like fucking simulating the experience of being someone that got like wounded back in like the 1600s, where you just kind of like get it cut off and then people just shrug and go, well, I've done literally everything we can do. I don't know what else to do. I can give you leeches. Get some dirt in there. But you didn't even cut it off or give them leeches. Yeah, I guess it's more of like, I guess what I'm really simulating is 16,000 BC behavior where you get wounded and 
immediately everyone's like, oh, you're dead. You can't harvest food anymore. You can't hunt. So you're nothing. Get out of the get out of the tribe. You're dead. You're now nothing. Look, I wouldn't have I wouldn't have sealed that guy in that box if it wasn't for the fact that he literally wouldn't do anything but attempt to wash his like wounded hand over and over and over again and spam my notifications. Oh, that was the other mod I added. I added a mod that makes like a sound effect when there's notifications on the fucking left because I truly can't. The amount of shit I missed that I really should have caught in real time that I just didn't because the game has a silent notification system. Uh had to get that and unfortunately all the mods only get added if you make a new save by the looks of things so yeah we will be doing a new one because i need all these things in my game <laughs> very important very important i'm sure this base will be beautiful yeah dude for sure, dude! Yeah, dude! Yeah! Yeah, it is! <clears throat> it's definitely gonna be really good! Everyone get excited! Oh, this is gonna be the best one yet! No, yeah, no, this base is gonna be so fucking good! Dude. Tomato, it's National Miners Day. Oh, that's cool. This one goes out to all the miners out there. Right on, man. Right on. Rock and stone. With an E-R. Chat, with an E-R. <laughs> rock and stone, dude, rock and stone. All right. I want to get into the game quickly today because we, we unfortunately do have a lot of work to do. Because again, starting from scratch, we're doing it, we're doing it clean because I don't know if you saw my last one. It was bad. It was bad. I'm gonna feel a lot. I'm gonna feel a lot better just looking at a nice clean slate. I think it'll give me more time to do the things I wanted to do. Like really, just make it worse for them. <laughs> it was awful. You see, the thing is, I can like I was like I could probably clean it up. I looked at it and I was like, the whole format of this place is like so like first base in RimWorld tier. You know what I mean? Where it's like, in order to fix it, I would have to rip up all the stockpiles, move them, rebuild all the walls, reformat the whole thing, and by the time I'm done, half of the dwarves will be dead, and I have to go around aquifers for almost fucking all of it to do what I want. I just couldn't. I ju I really just couldn't. I was like, I I'm gonna be, like, by in the time it takes me to fix it, I might as well just be in a new base. But yeah. Anyways, let's get on in there. I will have to make a new world because I don't believe mods uh, apply unless you add them in a new world when it's first created. So we're doing a new one. Yes. Will you be putting the description of any legendary craft works of your dwarves into an AI art generator. That'd be pretty fucking poggers. That's a really good idea and I would steal it, but don't I have to like pay AI? No, wait, hang on. AI art generators just steal art anyways. Yeah, I could probably just give them that for free. Give them some, they'll just spit out some bullshit from some uh, creator without their permission. Just kind of regurgitate that. I'd do that if I had a confirmation. I don't know anything about AI art generators and stuff because I know some of them are somewhat careful with like where they pull their AI art from. And I do think there's good applications of AI art, for instance, for D&D. 
things like that where you need a lot of art very quickly for your show and you don't have the resources to get one but there are some that uh there are some that are more careful about where they actually pull their uh their shit from than others to my knowledge I'd have to literally ask like Joe and Brett what they use because I think they've done the research on that to some extent. More so than I have. But yeah, I'm not about to use an AI art generator before I were to ask someone. Brett stopped using it. Yeah, I mean, it makes sense. I have, I have really no stake in it because I haven't used it, but, uh, it's a shame that a lot of them seem to be a very unethical approach to the situation. It's like a lot of AI art generator creators didn't really think about the response socially that their thing would have once artists realized that their work was being used for that system. But yeah, if one ever came out that like I could actually confirm is ethically sourced out and like not literally stolen from like thousands of artists, then maybe. <laughs> but that's a hard thing to verify. As long as you don't profit on the AI, is it still bad? Uh, yes. Just because something isn't a direct profit doesn't mean it isn't bad for the uh, community and for the uh, whole situation. It's still stealing. But anyways, uh, doesn't matter. That was just someone asking a question for something very specific. I didn't mean to get on a whole uh, tangent about it. New world. Disregard when it loads up <laughs> milkable. All right, all right, no one saw that. No one saw it anyways. Everyone shut up. No one saw anything. No one saw anything about anything. All right, it's uh, we're hearing a Kamo Inala. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Is there any like really good fucking characters out there in this one? Stealth Fludob. Uh, let's see here. Bore to a lot of humans doing things in this one. Kind of cringe. Uh. But anyways, there should be no aquifers anymore, which is the whole point of this world. Uh, there's no more aquifers. I've removed them. Had enough of them. No more water. I just can't deal with it. New fortress. But how will we drink? From the fucking river where we throw out the garbage. All right. All right, let's take a look around. So, uh, there should be no aquifers, so I don't need to look around too much. Now, I'm gonna want to look for something. Let's see here. Uh, we want to find something with, I would, I would say, some soil. I'd like some... Some, I'd like some soil, not deep soil, not no soil, but just some soil. And I would also really like it if the game could just put me somewhere with gold. <laughs> Thanks. And let's just go ahead and see where it spits me out. Woo! Let's go ahead and scan the whole map for me now for uh, helpful dwarf situations. Exactly the kind of place we want to be somewhere with gold. You got some stuff. Seems like it's mostly near mountains and uh, oceans. Definitely get something out of that. We'll just go ahead and ping us right down where there's some gold. Uh, we'll just let it do its scan. I'm seeing a lot of clear space right here on this mountain range for like a good old fashioned dwarven civilization. Un unpopulated. Which is what we like to see. Why gold? What did he just fucking say to me? What did he just fucking say? What? 
Surely he didn't say something that stupid. <laughs> Why gold? Why not platinum? Ban that person. For life. Alright. Ban that person for life. <laughs> Fake dwarf. <laughs> Some kind of elf or something. Alright, I don't know what else to say. Kind of pissing me off. All right. Anyways, uh, almost done scanning. We're gonna. I, I'm looking at right here, dude. I'm thinking right here. All right. So we got ourselves a nice. Oh yeah. Look at all this. All this. It's green. Is places where we have the choice. Uh, we have a nice solid amount. A lot of goblins here. Don't only want goblins in. This is. This is. I think. Oh yeah. Here we go. We got some soil. Right here. Clay, sand. Oh, yeah. All we had to do is go right around this giant dwarven hillock. Which is fine. Some soil. Oh, everything a man could desire in the hills. Tropical shrubland. There's not going to be a lot of trees out. See, I kind of want to, like, settle somewhere near these elves. Where are the elves at? There were elves at one point. Where are they? Is that elves? No, that's dwarves. Is that elves? That's dwarves. Lots of my boys out here. I kind of want to settle somewhere where there's like a, a good amount of elves I can antagonize by deforesting around them. Because that's just kind of like fun. I'd, I'd really love to piss them off a little bit. Kind of kind of see what they're up to. This is all like desert though. Uh, maybe like here. Ooh, hang on. We got, we got, uh, we got a human tower. This, oh, this is ter this is terrifying here. This is a uh, necromancer tower by the looks of things. Some kind of horrifying necromancer. Not sure I want to settle near a necromancer. Didn't really know the game was just going to offer me a necromancer base. Uh, let's see if there's there's a forest right here with uh, some soil. Oh, there it is. Goblins two days away, humans and elves a half day away. I'm thinking right here in this jungle of questing. Imagine all the business we're gonna get after we've... <laughs> Imagine all the business we're gonna get. All the questers are gonna come through our society and we're gonna cash out on that. The amount of pe the places... It might as well be called the jungle of commerce. And consumerism. We're gonna get so many people coming through here looking for like, like goods and stuff requesting. We're gonna cash out hard. All right. It's gonna be. It's not gonna be a jungle for too much longer. That was the problem. And all right, jungle means gorillas, and gorillas means gilk. <laughs> and we're really gonna need that jungle juice, baby. We're really. Need that jungle juice. It's gonna be huge. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a huge industry for us, chat. Gilk is gonna be big. Alright, we're gonna settle there. We don't need to plan anything. No planning necessary. We're just gonna go ahead and settle down. You've arrived! Uh we're settling an outpost uh for the glory of all of Udu Udarudil. Okay. We're here. We're here. We've named our place Amkinston Thod Glad Theaters. Here we are. All right. Uh, so let me take a look around right away. See what we got here. A nice flat surface to work with. Uh, no bullshit this time. We're gonna probably just dig a hatch. Uh, for this one, after we deforested like this area, we'll probably hatch it. Go down. Yeah, that should do. Right, we still are pretty high up. At elevation 49. Up in the mountains. High elevation. Am I seeing anything? Am I seeing? Let me take a look at our people. Okay, so we got Inith Ashman for Cod, the expedition leader. What's his deal? Adequate organizer. Trade is lifeblood of a thriving society. Okay, welcome, welcome, 80 year old. Okay, very good. He's hateful. <laughs> he's hateful. He's full of a lot of hate, full of a lot of darkness in that heart. 
We have a planter. Uh, Mestos. Okay, cool, cool, cool. We also have this fisher dwarf who's fishing, doing his job. Okay, good. A metal crafter, proficient, adequate at gem cutting and setting as well. This guy could make, Zuntir here could make some seriously good fucking crafts for us. Uh, we got a mason, proficient. All right, looking good, looking good. We also have a woodworker, Enod. They're competent, they're proficient in, in, the, in what we need. And we have a miner. Uh, proficient and skilled at appraising. Very good. Very good. Now, the more important thing at this point in the game is I really, really just need to take a look at what creatures are around. Nothing. It's a ghost town out there. Streamer, my eyes are too small to read the text. That sounds like an absolutely you problem. Bad eyes. <laughs> Bad eyes, Lena. Don't know what to fucking say. Skill issue. Skill issue. I don't know what else to fucking say. This is some big ass font. <laughs> All right. Here's the plan. Okay, first of all, first things first, I think we settle right here, this clearing, and clear out these trees. I'm gonna tell the boys to dig straight down. Can I make hatches? I, I'm guessing I can, uh, that's not really something I looked into before, but uh, I, as I can see here, it says doors slash hatches. So yeah, I can make hatches. We're gonna need to make sure we place those hatches down. We're gonna need to make sure we place those hatches down this time. Animals, the amount of times an animal at while I've been playing has seen stairs and been like, mmm, <laughs> something for me to tumble down, therefore being completely invisible to the player so I can attack anyone in the stairwell. Too many times. I'm not getting fooled like that again. But I'm thinking right here. Right here, we dig here. The good old two by two. And we're gonna go down right away to elevation 40 where it's totally flat terrain. All right, we're gonna do it at tens. It's gonna be a long fucking hole. We're gonna get to elevation 40 and we're gonna start building off from there. All right, clear this out. Let them start doing their thing. While that's happening, while that's happening, while that's happening, I guess I have a stockpile for wood. We're gonna put the wood stockpile right here. I just want a lot of wood all piled up somewhere so that we know where it is. So let me just pop on in there. I actually fucked it up. Wood stockpile placed. The only thing allowed in it is wood. Okay, for now all I want is wood. Any aquifers? I disabled them with a mod and I enabled milking gorillas. All right, how many more? I don't, I'm not gonna keep saying it. I'm not gonna keep saying it. Okay? Why gorillas? What are you so scared of? <laughs> what are you afraid that you what are you afraid of? What what's your problem anyways? I'm gonna let this what is this? We've struck microcline. I don't know what that means. Just keep digging down, man. Locum, keep digging down. We need this place cleared out. We just desperately need this place cleared out. Have we... So, loam... To my knowledge, loam is not... I'm just digging straight down because I'm also trying to find a surface with uh, farmable dirt that we can work with on this. I think loam is farmable. I believe loam is good. I think we can use that. So, we're gonna use the loam. We'll use that for the farming little voices. Tetrahydrite, bauxite, laminite, kalanite. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's real good. We're gonna get down a couple more levels. Yes, sirree. All right. 
Okay, very good, very good. Here's the plan. Here's what I'm planning. Here's my scheme. All right. Wherever, whatever level is our loam floor, which is one floor beneath. Very good. This is going to be dug out to be the new wood stockpile as well as farm level and etc. for our plump helmets and other mushroom based merchandise. All right, we don't want it on the surface. I never want these dwarves to go upstairs ever again. All right, that's where the fucking giant pigeons are the size of cars. Okay? That's where the giant pigeons are the size of cars. So I'm also going to dig out a ring around here because we are... Just so I have it marked the two, like, work levels. All right. Dig that out. Is this true? It's bad. All right, it's bad. But here we are. We've made it to a sandstone level. I like sandstone cavern floor. It looks nice. This is what we want. We'll let Locum do that. I'm also going to tell, like, eight of the other dwarves that they work in mining now. Which is probably not going to make them too happy, but alas, they're going to get used to it. All right. Uh, they're going to get used to it. All of you are um, going to be mining for a bit. Unless you're cutting wood. Because, um, guess what? You don't have a house right now, fuckers. <laughs> you don't have a fucking house right now, dude. If you want to sleep tonight, get digging. All right? We don't have all fucking day anymore. Okay? You know what? Everybody does this. <laughs> Let me just... Okay, I actually can't just say everybody does this, but I would if I could. All right, everyone, get back to digging. Go on now. Get down there. Get down there and dig. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right. Very good, very good. So I'm just going to go ahead and this is going to be wood zone. We're just going to go ahead and make like a big old spot here for this. Never run out of wood again, hopefully. I go ahead and just... I want this place to just look a little bit nicer. Just need it to look nicer than it did before. Because the last place had no format. It had no format. I'm going to cut out this spot here because we're going to put the carpenter here. And some other crap. The wood. Need that right away. It's going to be better than the last place. What killed the last place? Uh, interior design. Uh, it was structurally... Uh, there was an aquifer directly beneath the main stairwell, which fucked up everything, and then I literally never recovered from the spiral that was me having to change my original plan. And then I just kind of was like, I, I don't fucking even want to live here anymore. It got bad. It was literally interior design ruined it. And a lack of gilk. Alright. You can't install mods in a game that's already active. Did you know that? All right, this is all dug out. All right, so. We're gonna set up a hallway here. We're just gonna, first thing we're gonna do is dig out a little, a little old place. I don't know what that box is. That There's this text box that appears on top. We're gonna dig out this nice little old spot here as a kind of meeting area for these dwarves. Nice and simple. Dig that out. Then we're going to put the other actual stockpile section over here. And then we'll set up like goods and stuff. This is where we'll store all the actual goods. Nice. It's so important. The problem is with Dwarf Fortress, everything starts to look like a penis. <laughs> so every time I put down any ground or anything, I have to squint my eyes. Because I have to be like, am I making a cock? <laughs> is this base going to look like a cock? Is it going to be a dick when I'm done? And I don't want it to be. So we need to be careful. But yeah. Uh, uh, first things first. I need to find a dumping hole. To dump our stuff. So from the for the rest of time. Uh, I'm going to just... Let's see here, right here, like, <laughs> I need someone to dig a sinkhole. All right. I need someone to dig a sinkhole. So I'm just going to kind of tell someone to just start digging right here. 
a four by four. No, a five by, yeah, just we're gonna do, a, we're gonna make a sinkhole. I need a place to dump garbage. So we're just gonna get that done. Needs to be near the base, but I don't want stink to waft up. All right. So it needs to be kind of deep. Someone will get to that at some point. While that's happening, we're gonna make that farm. And get that started right away. All right, we don't wanna be waiting around this time. I fucked up too many times by waiting around. Farm plot. Bada bing. Farm plot done. Wait, no, that was gonna be, that's not, that's not the farm plot, that's the wood spot. Cancel that, cancel it. This is where the wood stockpile is gonna be from now on. Uh, farm plot's gonna be at the bottom. Farm plot's gonna be at the bottom. I just want a place that's indoors for the wood. Stop. Yeah. Okay. New wood stockpile. Wood. Done. Cool. Cool. Better. Uh, all of you, get the fuck out of here. Move everything downstairs now. All right, good. While that's happening. Gonna quickly make a carpenter. Put it right there. Make it out of uh, limestone. Sure. Very good. Very good. Now we can make those hatches and secure the depths. All right. Very good. Look at them. <laughs> they have no idea they're digging out the barracks. All right. Good. So this is gonna be the barracks. Uh, we don't. We're not gonna do. I'm just so tired of them thinking they're gonna live nice lives. You know what I mean? Which is why I'm making them this tiny little room where all of them will sleep all the time. Okay? That's the new plan. That's the new plan. The new plan is hull in wall. Uh, all right. So, I'm gonna just dig out like a path here. No, wait, no, 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 no. Here. Because I just want... I need a spot for all of the farming for now. This will be temporary, and we'll move this later, but I need something down. Intercept right there. Yeah, because that gives me space to put a farm thing and a still. Good. And we'll carve out the other side as well. Like so. Good. Penis check. We're good. <laughs> Cock check. It's not one. We're good. Check from the zoomed out minimap. Oh, no. No. We're good. Gorilla check. We need to check and see if there's gorillas. Hornbill. Oh. How big's a hornbill? Tiny bird with large... Okay. <laughs> okay. I don't care. Leave me alone. Leave my people alone. We don't care about them. Okay. So. We're slowly digging out the basic stockpile. A really basic one. And at the same time, I'm going to dig out this for actual, like, work. And then, we'll put another section over here for, like, finished goods right away. Oh, it's actually going to piss me off that these don't align right. Whatever, this can be adjusted later. This will be barracks, and this will be meeting hall. I'm going to set it for that right now. This will be where our people meet. Very good. Very good. They will meet here. They'll meet in this hole. This is where they live now. This is... Everyone's having a good time. No one's dead yet. We're striking ores. We're digging out the base. Who are those people? Okay, that's all fine. Okay, so here's the situation, chat. 
Uh, next thing to do is make sure that these uh, creatures are all held close to the base. This old clearing will do. I need to make sure that they all are kept here for now. I don't want them wandering downstairs yet. So, why are they all coming down here? Why are you guys doing this? Stay up where the grass is. What are you... There's nothing for you down here. What are you going to do? Eat fucking rocks? Stupid idiots. They want to be in the cool hole. I know. I know. But I mean, like, that's super duper not something I care about. I'll tell you what. You guys all hang out here now. Unless, okay, unless specifically... You're an animal that can be made into someone's pet. Like this dog. And this dog. And nope, none of these other ones. Maybe the bunny. Why, is, why do we have a bunny? <laughs> why do we have a bunny? Anyways. How about this animal will receive war training? Uh... Nah, these are just friend dogs. These dogs are dogs to be friends with, not not used to kill. They're friends. Okay, guys. So I know it doesn't look like much right now, but this is a dormitory <laughs> that people should sleep in. Okay, cool. Glad we all understand. We're gonna call it the hole. They're already- Zuntir's looking at it. <laughs> They're a little baffled by the living conditions, but they'll figure it out while that's happening. First things first. I need to make like a little line here. Because I need to make an office for a manager. We need a manager right away. Bada bing, bada bop. Office. Done. Does it come with beds? One day! Guys! I'm moving fast this time, okay? It's only been a week. It's only been a week, all right? We're still digging. It's, we're not done. Okay. We're still clearing out the farm. We'll just calm it down, take it easy. Rom wasn't built in a penis check? You're right. We're good. Wait. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Workshop. Okay, so I'm gonna make a still immediately just because I want it. Over, yeah. Out of macadamia logs. Gotta make sure I have that. And we're also gonna make a. Let's see here. We're gonna make a. Yep, a good old fashioned. Someone's always fishing. I know that. So a fishery is like actually full on necessary. We're gonna put on this side though. Fishery, okay. We're just gonna make everything for farming that I know I need right away. Fishery, butcher, log, uh, butcher, and tannery. Tanner. Good. And then we'll put the kitchen on the other side. Farming. Although we do need a farmer so that we can actually harvest the- we do- we need one more. Still. Uh, kitchen. Which one's this one? Tanners. Okay, so we need the kitchen. Workshop. Farming. Kitchen. Good. Bees this time? Last time we brought bees into the colony, they really fucked me over bad. Okay? Not really too inclined to bring bees back in. Just really not, after what happened last time. Anyways, workshop, farming, farm plot, shwing. And there, now we have a farm. Okay. All right. And the actual storage for farm stuff will go a level below. This is where we'll store uh, foods. For now. Food-based stuff will just go right here. Figure out the rest after. New fort? Yeah, I hated the old one. 
And we didn't have Gilk. How are we supposed to live without Gilk? We needed Gilk. And now we have it. Okay. Let me just go ahead and swim. Bing. Custom. Very important that we do this right this time. All minus corpses, none. Refuse, none. For the most part. I don't want corpses here. I don't want body parts here, but I'm fine with skulls, bones, shell, teeth, horns, hooves, and hair and wool being here. Uh, I need to make sure we have those in case some weirdo in the colony is like, I really have a mo I really want to make something out of horse teeth. Or I'm going to kill myself. So, well, you don't want to throw out all of it. Try to save that. Don't want to get rid of that. Sounds reasonable. That's how game works. <laughs> That's how game works. Don't want to get rid of all of it. Uh, we also don't want our finished goods up here because uh, there's no point having them up here. We want those closer to the exit. So no goods. Only raw ingredients to things here. Only the raw ingredients. Good. Nice, nice. Now I'm going to go ahead and... How's that hole going? <laughs> Very nice. Now I'm going to need this to go one more down. I'm gonna need this hole bigger. <laughs> Hole's looking good. We're gonna get deeper though. So when you guys get the chance, dig that. Nice hole, bro. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. I have a look. Here's the thing. You, you guys are gonna love this one's done. The hole's great. Oh, the hole's perfect. Man, this guy just won't stop fishing. I mean, it is their job, and we do need food. So I'm not going to complain. Where's, uh, so what's everyone up to? Are they transferring now? Turtle. Hang on. I really do need to be wise here and say, hey, you know what would be really cool? If we had a little spot here for fish stuff. And I'll just do the same over here. Getting a little worried about the shape of a cock, but I need a stockpile for fish because I don't want it anywhere else. And the fact that there's a turtle here means I need to edit that so it doesn't do that. Corpses, refuse. Hang on, what part of the turtle is this? Pond turtle. There's a whole pond turtle here. All right, some part of my stockpile is not what I want. Corpses. See, what I'm doing here, though, Chad, is I'm looking, and it says right here that no pond turtles are allowed. That's just there. That's just a pond turtle. Well, no food either. We don't want food up here anyways. So that should make that easier, because we want food here. Uh, this is going to be food. Uh, this is where all food will go once it's done. All food will go right here. All food stuff. Yeah, this was the big issue last time. It's alive? It's under animals. You're telling me I have a turtle broke into my house this time. Don't know if I believe it. Do something. Some Zuntir just picked. Dude, I don't know. When I check this thing, it's not going to say there's a turtle there. Because it's not a thing. Chat, Chat you guys just say bullshit. Like, I, I, I could have told you it was dead the whole time. That's why I was in the stockpile, not moving. Just killed the turtle. No. No, it was just being harvested because this person's outside fishing. You fools. Fertilize every season. Plump helmets. We harvest plump helmets here. We love plump helmets. 
farm that shit. Wait, did someone resign from being expedition leader? Enith, what's the fucking problem? Did someone quit? What do I care, man? How's the hole going? <laughs> yeah! Yes, dude! Finish that hole! And... One more, please. Oh, oops. Uh, deeper. I need it deeper. <laughs> I'm gonna need this thing even deeper. Okay. Very good. Uh, we're gonna make this really nice. How do they get out of the hole? It's a ramp. Right now. Currently, it's a ramp. I've made it a ramp for a reason. But I am gonna seal it up with a ceiling in a minute and just leave a hole in the middle for people to toss garbage into. It's a landfill. <laughs> it's a landfill. We're making a landfill. Okay? That's what this is. It's a landfill. All right. How's the food hall going? Looking good. Extend it. Looking good. Oh yeah, here we go, dude. See, the real problem is I got all this sandstone. Which, I mean, I guess I'm gonna build everything out of sandstone. I need to start making the uh, workshops and etc. for that. Stone worker, right here. We'll make it out of sandstone. We have a billion of it. Uh, let's see. Stone worker. We're also gonna make a... We already have the carpenter. Uh, metal smith. We'll put that right there. We have a bunch of iron anvils. We'll make more out of sandstone. Uh, we're gonna make a uh, workshop. Baby? Oh, there's a rabbit grew up. Uh, workshop, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna make a, uh, let's see here, a furnace right away, smelter, bada bing, add a sandstone, gonna go ahead, workshop, uh, nope, workshop, and then a craft station, put that right there, add a sandstone, then we're gonna go ahead, bada bing, workshop, one or two more of these and we'll be halfway done. Jeweler, bada bing, sandstone. One more and then we're done, baby. One more. All right. I'm done getting pushed around by flying creatures. <laughs> so we're making a Boer's Workshop, okay? I'm leaving space here because I know I'm going to add more rows of these things. I'm going to cut out some more space here as well. I'm going to connect it here because this is going to be where finished goods go for now. We'll extend it later, but finished goods are going to go on the end. Once all this shit's done, We'll be able to start giving people rooms. How's the hole? How's the hole, boys? Y'all better be doing some good stuff if that hole ain't done. They're slacking. That hole should be done by now. The fact that the hole isn't done gives me a lot of... a lot of doubt... in our society, to be frank. Why do we got lungs? Why do we got prepared alpaca lungs? Like, I know I didn't tell us to make any... I know I didn't tell us to harvest alpacas yet. Our alpaca's good. I guess the caravan came with lungs. <laughs> I mean, cool, man. It's cool. It's honestly kind of epic. Uh, anyways, it's time to make that. It's time to make what we need for the manager. So I'm going to go ahead. We're going to start making everything out of sandstone. 
Hopefully it's done soon. We're waiting for these boys to finish crafting all these stations, and we're going to make the manager's office right there so that we can start putting in our work orders, and then we can start spitting out the uh, stuff we need for these boys. But, I mean, hey, already moving much faster than base number one, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. What's the Gilk mod? Wouldn't you like to know? Is it over? There we go. New task. Rock throne. New task. Uh, table. New task. Uh, door. Good. All of them made out of limestone. We want consistency this time, chat. I don't want no fucking sneeze looking base. <laughs> I'm tired of that. We got limestone, that's what we're keeping. Everything else garbage. We like limestone here. All right. Someone will make that stuff soon. And all this other stuff's getting spat out real quick. Oh yeah, we got um a lot of turtle shells. <laughs> hey, um, Hey guys, throw these out. <laughs> I know I said we could keep them. I meant to say you can throw them in the garbage. Stop bringing them down here. I might have to tell them no more keeping turtle shells. You can make shell crabs with them. Didn't ask. I know that for sure. I didn't ask. Anyways, uh, I am going to uh, take a look and see if they finish the hole. They're slacking on the hole. They're not finishing the hole. Why have they not finished the hole as I've requested? <laughs> Why are they disregarding my instructions? How dare they? Is it because I've given them too many other tasks and they're getting confused? God, they need to... We have a lot of turtles. I guess I'm going to tell them to start... Extracting, uh, preparing raw fish. We've got a lot of turtles. Um. Turtles count as raw fish? Or do I need to actually butcher... Uh, do I need to butcher turtles? I think turtles count as fish. We'll see which one they go for. This place is gonna start stinking. Like death. I mean, the turtle shells are all in there. They're doing it from there. They're doing it from there. They're harvesting the turtle shells. All right, I'm going to tell them to start just cooking fine meals then to burn through some of that. Uh, and at the same time, <laughs> I I just fucking, I wish that I was confident. One, I wish they'd finish the hole because I was going to, I wanted to make this even deeper, but they're not going to, I guess. So I'm going to cancel this part of it. I'll have to settle for what I have. Uh, if you guys would be so kind as to create a, a couple floors at this level out of uh, limestone. No, sand. Limestone. Limestone. Make it all out of limestone. We're just gonna make. We're just gonna make a big hole in the middle. Yeah. Yeah, and then we'll do uh, one more set here. And we're gonna tell them that that hole in the middle is the dump. And then there will be no more confusion among our people. Our people will finally understand. Okay, who's our local uh, hall boy? We don't really have a local hall boy. It's usually like, oh, I know who's local hall boy. You. Fisher Dwarfs. You don't do that anymore. We have enough fish for a while. You know what you do now, Fisher Dwarf? You haul. You're a hauler. But everybody does do this. Okay, everybody does haul. But I do want to say... I do want to say... That, uh... 
Workers dump corpses. <laughs> this has been the problem we've been dealing with. Workers dump corpses and workers gather outdoor refuse. And they gather outdoor vermin and they huck them in the trash. Okay? They gather this shit, they throw it in the garbage. Now, as a, as a bonus to this, because I've had enough of it, we're gonna set up our barrow now, because I've had enough of it. Or burrow. Okay, so this is basically the rim world equivalent of like what your home is. And we're just gonna say, this right here, home. This right here, all home. Here, home. And here, home. All this, home, all this, home, and then all this going down, home. Oh, this actually doesn't recognize the multiple levels, I guess. It should. No? Okay. We're going level by level for that, then. I'm just going to grab all these. And then they'll, they don't necessarily fall these perfectly to my knowledge, but, uh, it'll at least make it so I can just label all of this place as okay for them. Not all the time, but, uh, they won't be wandering around the fucking streets getting mauled by giant gorillas anymore. When the time comes, they will be safe. When the time comes, they will not die. Okay. Now then. Has the stonemasons thing been completed? Cool. The, ch the limestone throne and table are done. They just need to haul it. I believe everyone's ordered to haul now. I need to set... Has the, has the floors been finished? No. Really just hinging all of our time on that right now. Really need them to finish that before the lungs start to stink. Before the lungs start to stink and then people start to have their fucking mental breaks. Why is that piglet down here? I thought I told that pig he wasn't allowed to be down here. Wait, item inaccessible? What item? <laughs> well, yeah, I don't want you- I don't want you going after those items. Those are garbage. It's because of the burrow. I'll have to disable it. This is mainly for later anyways, but uh... Good, they're finishing the floor. <laughs> they really want those! <laughs> they really want those turtle shells. Just finish the floors. Is he gonna seal himself in? I swear if one of these dwarves actually seals themselves in here like an idiot, I'm gonna be sad. They really crave the shell, dude. What are you even grabbing? They're hauling more pond turtle shells. Well, at least I told the guy to stop farming or fishing. So that'll be the end of that. That'll be the end of that fucking nightmare. <laughs> That's all turtle shells! That's it! Turtle shells are bad! From society! Did we got space for this many shells? Dude. No more. None of them. We, evidently, if someone wants turtle shells, we can find them. Evidently, no one's gonna have any problems getting turtle shells. All these are trash. Every, t every shell you see, as far as your eyes can see. He's garbage. They're so fixated on the shell thing, they won't even do the mining. Oh, finally. Okay, we can put out our work order in a second. People are finally hauling the doors. It just took a thousand years. Has the ceiling of that hole been finished? No, but almost. They're, they're moving. Remember, chat, don't tell them what to do. Okay, at this point, I feel like you don't even need to tell them. If they can't see the pinned message at the top, you can just ban them or time them out. I feel like at this point, uh, that pinned message is all of the work you needed to do. If they ignore that, 
Uh, they don't care what you say, and it's time to it's time to punish them for it. I'm just trying to be nice. I know, but you've tried hard enough. You don't know it to people that won't listen. The pin message is there. You've got your out, so, you know. If you want to try to be nice, that's on you, but you can also save yourself the time. I won't, I won't be upset if you save yourself the time. But, uh, yeah. Uh, what was I doing here? I need to start getting that alcohol done. We need to start getting some alcohol made now. All of our plump helmets are going to get made into that good good. Everything we've got. Okay. Very good. Has the hall been finished? Has anyone accidentally sealed themselves in? No? Good. Good, good. All right. Once this last part's done, We'll label this open space as a dumping ground. Good, good. This now and forever is specifically a dump. Hang on. Animals assigned to pit slash pond zones are dumped in the pit. <laughs> Alive! <laughs> Can you have multiple zones in the same spot? Can I have a dump and a pit? In the same- in the same one by one? Yes. Well, this is a pit. Pit. Call that the pit. And for testing purposes, uh, we're just gonna send this, uh, this really, this guinea cock right to the pit. We're gonna see if anyone does it. I'm just kind of curious. Get that guinea cock in the pit already. <laughs> Yo, Inith, really into just dumping this bird in the pit. <laughs> They're in the pit, dude! Uh, sent it to the depths. All right, so uh, that works. The pit works for that. All right, now uh, it escaped. Well, the bird could fly out. It's a bird. It might be able to, but uh, I'm also going to now label this, if it'll let me, as a uh, garbage dump. Which it looks like I can also do here. And if it overwrites it as a pit, that's fine. Uh, dump. We're just gonna call it a dump. Uh, we want people hucking stuff in there. Can so can we please huck some shit into this pit now? I really need to see the boys, like, throwing shit into this pit that I tell them to throw into the pit. Like, I really, really need to make sure that labor is happening. Haulers. Everybody's set to do this. Standing orders, because I think it's like standing orders, hauling refuse and dumping workers, gather refuse, workers save bones, shells, workers dump shells. We dump shells. Shells are going in the garbage. We're done with shells. Okay. We don't keep shells anymore. All this should be going in the pit with the bird. Forever. Okay. Well, that was good. What's this? The guinea cock is fighting. What was he fighting? <laughs> wait, 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 who's the guinea cock fighting? I'm, uh, unsure of who. The ground? Rocks? Dude, I just don't really have time to worry about it. I gotta set up the manager now. Okay. Furniture, chair, 
Bada bing, limestone throne. Okay, furniture, table, bada bing, limestone table. The shells, guys! The shells! What's the difference between a rock and a block? Though? You know what I mean? What's a rock block? What's a rock block do for me that a normal rock doesn't? Blocks have limited uses. Blocks are for building. Well, I only want to use the limestone for building. But I don't want more rocks. Get several blocks from a rock. Okay. I don't really want that. The problem is, this place wouldn't look so fucking crowded if it wasn't for the 8 million shells that these guys just really... will never throw... I just don't understand why no one will... Alright, I know what I have to do. You. <laughs> Enod. No, he's doing like... Plant no, 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 no. Someone else is doing that. You, Enod. Your job? Okay. It's about to get a lot more boring. Your job's gonna get a lot more boring going forward. Because your only job is to haul. And you're only doing that. And you know what you're gonna fucking do? You're gonna haul trash. And shells. Get fucking to it. And you know what? I wanna watch him fucking do it. I've had enough of this. I've had enough of people not doing it. He's planting right now because he was in the middle of it. But the second he's not in the middle of it, he better start throwing fucking shit into the garbage. Okay, he's currently grabbing these rough sard sardines. What was he doing? He's hauling plump helmet stews up into the plump helmet stew bin. Okay. He's grabbing some rocks. He's hauling barrels, doing as he should. This is good. We needed this guy to be doing this. He's now moving things where they should be instead of where they used to be. This is good. We now have a guy doing what's been very necessary for this fucking team for a long time. Good. That was the most important thing we could possibly have done. So hungry. Why is he hungry? He's not hungry. He's happy. He's having the time of his life. All right. He's satisfied at work. He's happy. He loves hauling. Why would you even suggest he doesn't? He's having the time of his life. Okay, I need to set up something at the kitchen. That's really important. Because I know... Because I can see plump helmets in here. Doesn't matter initially right now, but I need to make sure that in the future for the kitchen... When we put in real orders for it, they're not going to cook plump helmets into food because those are only for alcohol. Uh, where would I kitchen? Ingredient type. Only allowed for alcohol. Okay. Only allowed for alcohol. There we go. Now they won't do that. Good thing I remembered to do that. How's the pit doing? Just one bird. Oh, oh, and by the way, oh, and by the way, guinea cock, you're exiled. I'm going to name him something so people get confused when they see it. Why didn't it rename him? It never saves it. Why? Why, dude? Can someone explain the difference between these two name rows? I need that. That might be the most unknowable thing in this game. First and last name. Nickname and title. I've pressed enter. I've done. It just won't save it. You gotta right-click after. 
It moves it up to the top one immediately. Okay, well, I got there. It only took 18 tries. Okay. Why is there a dead rat in here? <laughs> Why? Why, guys? Guys, I know we don't eat that. I know we don't eat it. I just really fucking... Like, here's the problem, dude. We don't need this many rocks. So I'm gonna simplify this for my boy, the trash man. And I'm just gonna go ahead and say every fucking rock on this level... ...is garbage. I wanna see him fucking throw some shit into the trash. Can we see some fucking actual hauling? In this video game. Where's my hauler? Where is he? Where's the one boy who does hauling? I know where you, where are you at, dude? You. Enod. It says he has no job. Chat. At this point, I need someone to fucking help me with this. Like, it, it, it's, he literally, like, literally people won't do the garbage job. Like, they really won't do it. And I don't understand why. I just don't get it. Bro, just set them to haul? You set up the work detail. Labor. Only allowed to haul. Labor. Haulers. Everybody does this. Enon. Set to only haul. Standing orders. Hauling. Workers gather bodies, minerals, food, wood, etc. Refuse and dumping, where the workers gather all of th these things. He's not set. He's not set to anything else. I think the assigned tasks only tick box means they can only do tasks at workshops assigned to them. It says here that he will only... I mean, yeah, I mean, I can untick it, but that... I guess we'll see. No, he still just says he doesn't have a job. It's so frustrating. There's like, this place is infested by rocks, and no one will do it. You set the burrow. If, my, if he's not in that burrow... If he's in that burrow... All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Guys, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, the burrow currently has a pause on. I paused the burrow. It's been paused the whole time. It's suspended. That's what it looks like when it's not suspended. It's been off. It's off. It's not on. Guess I'll see if he, like, moves. Because right now the only person doing anything is this miner. I think you need to assign the dump as the tile next to the hole and they'll throw it in. I'll try it. At this point, I'll try fucking anything. I don't think that saved it. No, it did. Are you doing your thing now? Dump item! They're dumping! They're dumping! Are they gonna dump into it, though, or are they gonna dump? Please dump in the hole. They're, <gasps> They're dumping! They're finally throwing out the garbage! Little idiot has no idea what's going on. Fucking finally, dude. It took a thousand years of strife, but our people can finally be free. <laughs> They're dumping. That is the du Dude, the fact that there was a thousand fucking insane suggestions, then one person finally said the right answer is insane. 
One person. That was one guy. One guy got me out of there. One. One guy. But I guess that's been the case with Dwarf Fortress, is one guy says the actual thing everyone else is saying insane shit that I've already tried. <laughs> okay. Uh, door. We had a door here. War. I'm stoned. Need to finish this guy's office. Because this isn't even his room. <laughs> They'll finally start taking these turtle shells out, dude. We have space again. This is good. Okay, while that's happening, uh, I need to get the fucking managers. Is this finished? Place that. Good. Perfect. Now. Zone. Office. This right here is an office. Specifically for whomever is about to be the manager. Okay. Who is going to be the manager, though? That's the question. We have to choose that now. Does anyone... Okay, it's the expedition leader, whatever. Two birds with one stone. He's the only one who knows anything about organization. It's his office. Let him take it. While that's happening... We need to finally take care of beds. We need to... We need, like, uh... We need houses. So once he's all set up there, okay. Uh, bed. Make bed. Ten of them. Use... Uh, macadamia wood. Sure. We have a lot of macadamia wood. Make beds. Once you're done with that, God, I love I love work orders. Now that I know how they work, I don't know how anyone would so, like function without uh, work orders. We need just some rock doors. We're gonna make two of them. Make two rock doors out of sandstone. Uh, and then once you're done with that, we are gonna make uh, hatches. We need the hatches out of rock. Also, we only need four of those. Sandstone. There. Gonna finally secure this place, Chad. It's been a thousand years, but we finally can. At last. This place is coming together. Everything's been cleared out. We set this place as a finished goods section. For now, this will be where we take finished goods. Goods. Nice, nice. It only took forever. But we finally have a place to put all of our finished goods. Finally. Give the poor lads mugs. I haven't even given them beds, motherfucker. Okay? One thing at a time. Let them move all the garbage out finally. Yeah, what's up, idiot? <laughs> How you doing in the hole? Looking good. Looking good, boys. Can we get these rat remains out of here? Can get the garbage taken out, boys, please? Oh my god, it's so much more organized, dude. I do want to cut down some more trees. Can just get some of this shit cut down. Good. He gonna get crushed one day, if he's a fool, perhaps. Uh, garbage. All right. But we're stable. There's still things we need, but uh, first thing I want to do, it's summer. We got to make sure that we take care of goods. I want to actually have things to sell to the fucking work, like the uh, depot people this time. And I also need to build the depot. So I'm going to construct that. We need the trade depot somewhere. We'll put it right where this tree will be gone once it's cut down. Right where, Right there. Depot. Turtle craft, we're throwing out all those fucking turtle shells. Screw that shit. Why are there still so many? It's because of all the rocks. They're throwing out the rocks still. They're using wheelbarrows to throw out rocks. It's fine, whatever. It's gonna take a little bit to move all these rocks out of the way. It's fine. All right. Craft with them, damn it. You shut up. What is this? Oh, the doors are done. The doors for the, for the spot are done. Fine, good, good. It's good. All right. Get these doors placed. Door. Keep building. 
Good. The barracks are almost done. Everyone's gonna sleep in the same, like, sweaty hole. Alright? We're not- we're not changing that. It's gonna stink in there, it's gonna be disgusting, but they're gonna learn to be happy with what they have. They should be damn grateful that I even gave them that. Sweaty? I assume this whole place is sweaty. To be honest. Anyways, install... Uh, the beds. Let's get these down. Macadamia wood beds. Yes, siree. The people will learn to be grateful for what I have given them one day. The dormitories are finally being placed. Yes. That'll fit 12 dwarves. At the same time, are you sleeping at your fucking workstation? We're making some good sandstone hatch covers. It's just like, hey lady. Hey idiot. Uh, you made them both look different because you made one of them way better than you should have. Also, I need another two of them. I fucked up. But this one's way nicer than the other one. And I kind of need them all to look the same, so you're gonna have to make one of them again. Uh, like those are different ones, dude. Those are different fucking hatches. Turtle shell hatch. Oh, they are making the hatches. Okay. I thought I put in only two for some reason. All right, fine. You could keep it for now. Start installing them. This will finally protect our people from the outside world. Hatch. 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 Yeah, dump all that garbage right in there, dude. Right on. Ah, oh, there we go. We finally have hatches. We're secure. It took a thousand years, but we got there. Is this one la is the last one not done yet? I love how it's there the second I stop clicking on it. Hatch. Done. Cool. The dump is gonna start smelling soon? No, it isn't. No, it fucking isn't. No, it won't be. That's a lot of stuff in there. But it's not my problem. And good news is stray idiots always gonna have food to eat. So we're gonna dump crap down there all the time. God, this is great. This is really something. Uh, why have we not cut any, uh... Why, why, we, why, why, why is the woodworker not cut anything recently? Oh, it's because I took away his job. <laughs> you wanna fucking get back to it? Jackass? When you're done hauling that giant rock? Is that a colony of bumbles? Well, bumblers? Bumblebees. Do this other thing now. Do what I tell you to, all the time, now. Wait, what are they scared of? She's terrified while in conflict. Well, why, what happened? Poor empathy, poor focus, very bad intuition. Overcome with terror. Well, what conflict? I don't care. I'm just worried I'm gonna like see- Oh my god, we need more barrels. Gonna need more barrels than this. Alright. Hey, at least some people have beds now. Let's install the last of them. Ah, uh, yeah. This is good. This is- now this is nice. Get all these installed. And then after that, can we put in a work order for like, let's say 10, uh, cabinets? You can make them out of rocks, I just don't care. Make 10 of them out of sandstone, thanks. And how much longer until all these turtle shells are finally gone? Look at them, they're happier than ever, chat. The people are happy. I'm also gonna put in a work order for, uh, 10, uh, tables. Possibly more. 
waiting for the random giant horde to come wipe your colony out. Why would you be waiting for that, you sicko? What? What? Chill, man. Chill. Chill, man. What are you, crazy? What are you, fucking maniac? Why don't you just take it easy? Unhinged. A little weird. All right. Oh God, this doesn't look like a dick, does it? No, we're okay. Everything's fine. All my dwarves are having an average time. That's good. That's good. Uh, are there any? Oh no. Well, first of all, there's this little lizard. I'm not too worried about them. But there's also this giant Owl, hang on, is it giant or does it just, uh, how big are we talking? A small, oh, I don't care. <laughs> right, never mind, I don't care. We're almost done dumping all this garbage. And then that guy will probably get back to cutting wood again, or so I hope. Because his job does include uh, doing that. We've almost gotten rid of all the rocks. And we'll finally be free. We'll finally be free. I'm actually going to untrash that rock and untrash that rock. Because uh, sandstone's good. All right. Very nice. Then we can start digging down again. We're gonna start digging down again, chat. Don't get excited, chat. Gonna start digging down. Deeper. Also, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put in some orders for things I know are gonna be problems later and I just kinda want them on the docket. Uh, barrels, make them. Uh, out of like wood. Make a wooden barrel. Like 10 of them. And also, uh, mugs. You can make some, uh, mugs. Good, good. Good, we're gonna need mugs. I also need to make, like, an actual proper dining hall. Because it's like a meeting area. It's not really for that. So we're gonna start carving out a nice little area. Where we will eat. Too big. Just too big. We don't want these people to get, start thinking that they're being treated, right? Just like that. That's good. That's good. That's, that's good. That's good. A big old, big old box. Yeah, they'll live like that. They'll live like that. They'll be, they'll love that. They'll be pleased with that right there. We'll connect it on this side. All right, cool. Uh, why aren't they working faster and harder? <laughs> why are they not? Why are they not working faster? And uh, I'm just kind of wondering, like, uh, like, I don't know, why are you not uh, crafting more things? What are you crafting? Oh, you're making the mugs? Okay, that guy's doing his job right. Good. Good, good. I'm cool. Everything's fine. <laughs> Everything's fine, guys. We don't need to... We don't need to get all crazy. Start getting that shit all placed down. Alright, it's time to start really packing this uh, place full of people. Really just... Gonna cut this place out a little bit longer. Most dwarves are gonna live inside of this room. Okay? <laughs> most... Most dwarves are gonna find that this is where they live. It's gonna be a big old room full of guys. It's gonna be just a gross mess. Oh, hang on. Uh, goods. We're gonna change this to not include mugs because I actually want the mugs to be near the dining hall. And I also want the finished alcohol to be near there as well. And the finished food. We're gonna move all that stuff around soon. All that stuff's gonna be slid around. It started raining. 
Don't dwarves get incredibly furious when it rains? <laughs> Don't dwarves just get absolutely fucking PO'd as hell when it starts to rain? And then they start killing people? Dwarves hate water, yeah. Yeah, look, dude, the hole's getting filled up, dude. Woo! Yes, dude! Idiot doesn't know what's going on! Wait, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Wait, chat. Is there... Is there a hole here? Is that a... Is that a hole? Is there a hole? Was that where a tree used to be? So there's a giant fucking hole leading into my base. Enhance. Anonymous gifter, thanks for gifting 20 subs. That giant fucking hole. There's several holes. I only care about the ones that go into my base. Thanks for the gifted subs. I'm only seeing the one hole. I'm gonna plug it. Limestone. Skylight? I don't want a skylight. <laughs> I really, really don't know how to say. I super don't want a skylight. Okay, other thing we need. I'd like to extend this stockpile a little bit more. Just a bit. Some migrants have arrived. Wait, you didn't bring any of your friends? <laughs> just, just one of you? Just one of you. Just one person? One, uh, what do you do? Uh, Lalore? Akum, I, 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 Akumi Mush. Carpenter. All right. Uh, let's see here. Uh, uh, it was raining on me. It makes me so grouchy. No one asked. Uh, accomplished carpenter, talented fisher dwarf, novice cheesemaker, novice woodcrafter, novice mechanic. Uh, great affinity for language and great feel for the net for surrounding space. Okay. Oh wait, there's other people. Did I have? Oh, I used to have seven people. There's more people. Uh, Mesbuth, a legendary bone carver. All right. Good news is Mesbuth, we got like eighteen thousand turtle shells in that hole. You just got to go in it and get them. All you gotta do if you want the bones is you gotta go into the bone hole. We got this hole we've been dumping all the bones in. The problem is it's guarded by this giant fucking, like, bird. <laughs> it's guarded by this bird that we threw down there too. We never cleaned it out. We don't know if it's alive. We hear growling sometimes. Birds don't growl, which is the weird thing. But we know it's growling and it's the bird because it goes like... It makes, like, bird sounds at the same time, but then it growls. Just be careful going down there. Because if you lose your hands, we're going to seal you at all. Who's the other one? Whoa, 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 we're getting way more people. Hold up. So we got the legendary bone carver. We got talented bow guy named Bim. <laughs> Bim Sedilladin. What's up, Bim? <laughs> What's good, Bim? Hey, Bim. Bim the bower. All right. We got uh, them. We're looking for people that can fill office jobs. Uh, I'm sorry, do you not have a talent? Okay, Enod. No talents. Labors. Good news is you're now set to do what is, I would say, a very rewarding lifestyle. She only, listen, if you're 73 coming into this zone and you don't have legendary skills, this person's 44, they have legendary skills. No talent? Fuck out of here. What about you? Uh, Toulon, the herbalist. All right, welcome to the herb team. Competent spirit dwarf. We need to start putting together a, uh, we need to start putting together this. 
Okay. It's covered in water all over every part of his- Dude, this guy's saturated in water. That's a lot of water. Damn. Hi, right, man. Well, welcome to the team. Team. Who the fuck are you? One-year-old dwarven child. What's it? So you tell me just because you're one, you you don't need to have like a fucking actual like direction in life. Not one positive in her entire fucking like, in her whole sheet. Not one good thing about him. Listen here, bozo. <laughs> You got two years to figure out your direction in life, or you're dead. All right? Well, you got any, like, needs I should know about? Untroubled by unmet needs. Like, we just want this child to, like, you know, really figure out their shit. It's like, I wish I could just exile the child. Cause like, they're- they're in the way! Like, I don't know... Like, they're gonna eat a lot of food. They're gonna eat a lot of food and I just don't really... I just like, don't really care about them. Prepare a cough. <laughs> Can I label a child as garbage to be dumped? <laughs> Chat. Can I label a child as garbage to be dumped in the pit? Or is that a little dark, quote unquote? Well, hey. Good news is, stuff's going well. We got barrels, we got a lot of stuff. Uh, we got more beds to place, which will make people even happier. Yes, we're packing them side by side like sardines into a can. Yeah, I know. I know it. Yes, uh, it's not great. But, hey, you know. Don't fucking move here if you want to be happy. De doy. Stupid. Stupid. Your fault. Your fault. Not mine. How the mug's going? Good, look at all those mugs. That's actually way more mugs than I thought I ordered. Do we get like more mugs per thing? If I remember correctly, you can make a warren for just that baby. It's just one square over the hole, LMAO. What the fuck's a warren? You mean a burrow? You mean I just make a burrow? Hey, kid! <laughs> yo, uh... Yo, kid! You wanna check out this cool hole? Oh, she's already there! She's already checking it out! <laughs> Alright, I got some good news, kid. Uh, first of all... I want you all assigned to this burrow. Except... For what's your name? Uvash? All right, right on, Uvash. Right on. Right on. Welcome to the team, Uvash. Welcome to the team. Yeah, I actually didn't add her to begin with. Uh... Yep. Uh, we're gonna label this like a kind of scary... red. I'm gonna make it look like it's where we send people when they need medical attention. Very cool. 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 Hey, Uvash, I need you to go to the hospital, okay? This seems like they're a little confused. Uvash, I, I give you a direct order. Go to the hospital now. Right now. It seems like they don't want to go to it. 
Chat. I mean, like, maybe if I make it one more down as well. Maybe if I make it the whole tube. Get in there. Now oh, they're playing make believe. They don't even know where the fuck they are. Why would they not listen to me? It's my mess. What the fuck's going on? With Uvash right now. Huh. <sighs> Guess I'll let Uvash hang out in the team for now. Fine. Is what I would say. Okay, the second I do it, she's just like, I don't want to do that. But I mean, I could, if I added like one spot here for it. Nah, she just doesn't want to. Damn it! Fine. Go on over there and. Damn it, I was half hoping she'd just fling herself in. Okay, well, whatever. Look, we're doing a lot better this time than we were before. We all know this. Uh, although, I think it is time that we resume fishing. We've had our fishermen not fishing because I didn't really want them to do it. I think it's time we send them back on fishing. All right. We got two fisher dwarves. Wait a minute. If you're only proficient in it, you're fired. You're holler and minor. Lalor. Ikumi Mush, congratulations, you are our professional fisherman. Why are people not dumping stuff in the garbage? No, they're dumping. They're dumping. Cool, cool, cool. What I wanted to do was, uh, and I just remembered this was something I wanted to do before. I just want to make a little spot here. Uh, except, and I just want this place to be for specifically, can I do one that's like just fish? Oh, wait. All undo, none, fit. What the fuck? Dude, the second that you're not in a menu and you start typing, you just break the whole game, man. You just break the whole fucking game. Can you name your weakest dwarf after me? I got a one-year-old. <laughs> I got a one-year-old be trying to trick into falling into a pit I made. <laughs> you want him, Joe? They're just they're just a little idiot. There's actually there's this hole we made, a sinkhole that we're using for our garbage. And we got this uh stray idiot bird in it. And I got this burrow uh, that I named the hospital, which is really just a hole. Wait, chat, is there a way to, is there a way that I could set up a lever with a hatch and trick dwarves into standing on the lever and pulling it and dropping themselves automatically into the pit? Could I order them to do that? They can try and dodge while it sounds like if they do that, they're in. It sounds like if they do that, they're in the colony. I have no issues with that. Retractable. Chat, I don't know if I want to get into automation. Is there one that's just like... Hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, hatches can be placed at the top of stairwells or above ramps. Ah, uh, no, we don't want above ramps. Hmm. It'd have to be a machine. <laughs> Place a well in open space above water to provide a relatively safe area for your assistance to draw water. You can go above an empty space. Hmm. 
Yeah, I just don't want to use a retractable. Bridges can be used to span open spaces or placed above water. Magma bridges can be connected to levers. Okay. So what I'd basically want to do here, chat, is place a br But would that fuck up? That would fuck up the whole part, wouldn't it? Let me see first if I make it, because it'd be a lot cheaper and easier for my brain if it just let me make a hatch. Let's see if I'm allowed to just do that before we go making... Let's see if I can actually put a hatch over it. Because I can just cut... I can get rid of the floor and just make another, like, section to dump. But, I mean, it's like a micro-project. Anyways... Uvash. Uvash is like kind of pissing me off anyways. Is this, does this really speak to, is this really, is this really Joe here though? Is this really, I feel like I could get someone even more pathetic if Joe really wants the most pathetic guy. She's hauling? Yeah. You know, maybe that's the issue. Maybe we haven't actually properly set up, like, a system of forcing these kids to do labor. Hang on. Chores. <laughs> Uvash! <laughs> Alright, they're doing everything they can. Maybe we just leave Uvash to do this. Maybe we just don't fuck with it. They're functioning. You know, I need to check if turtles are allowed in this. God damn it, is there really not a way to just be like, hey, all things that you fish up are allowed here? Well, I don't want pond turtle men. I don't, definitely don't want a turtle men. I shiggy diggy doo wop, thank you for the five gifted subs. Make her build the prey. <laughs> Look, she's doing a good job throwing out garbage. I'm not going to complain about that. It does it does work. It's working. Let's just let's just count that as a win for now and focus on the shit that's more important, like getting like the dining area done. All right. Cuz we need we need stuff done. We're going to make a little side section here where we will stow food and mugs and etc. Okay. That'll be where we put our food, like finished, like alcohol drinks. How many tables we got? Oh, the tables are coming in. Okay, good. Good, good, good. It doesn't look centered, but I know it is. Really wish there was a faster way to do this in bulk, though. Feels like dining rooms just take a while to make. Use closest material. Yeah, but I wish it would just let me paint the spots, and then when it's done, like, RimWorld style, it would just automatically go. You know what I mean? Is kind of what I'm saying. Is I wouldn't mind it if it would just be like, hey, here's everywhere I want this table to go. Just do it like that. Is there, is, chat, this is something I'm actually really curious about. Is there a way that I can just, like, get a pile of, like, mugs without them all being one by one, like, blocks in a corner? Or do I really just have to have a closet the size of a, like, house full of mugs? Bins. And that, and that's, and that's not gonna, like, fuck up anything. Okay, so I can put, like, a bin in the corner. Okay, then I can just have the barrels of alcohol in here, then. Uh, alright. Work order. Let's get some bins. Order, damn it. Bin. These are bindings. Bin. Rock. Bin. Okay. Wood. Bin. Okay. Bin. We'll just scroll down.
You tell me we got rock gold bin. Okay, wooden bin. I guess wood bin was just not it. We'll make a. Uh, we'll make some bins, a couple bins. God, this place is really coming together though. That's the thing about it. You know what I mean? Like this place used to be a shithole. It still kind of is. But uh, you know, it's coming together. Tables, cabinets. It's better than the last place, all right? Everyone knows that. No one's doubting it. It's way better than the last place. Okay, yeah, this... Oh, there we go. Yeah, that is the thing. Whoever said that was right. Let's use the closest material. Makes it a little bit faster. Still doesn't exactly do what I want because I'd like it to automatically place them even if I don't own them and just assume that I'll have them eventually. But it gets it done a little. Okay. Very good. Very good. Just set up those bins. And then we'll start actually mining and playing Dwarf Fortress. What? Oh, the bins are done. Okay, so I'm going to place... No bins. I'm going to place... Uh, um, uh, um, I'm gonna place, um, fuck, uh, no, um, first I'm gonna place the dining hall, obviously, okay, first I'm gonna make a dining hall, I'm not an idiot, and then I'm gonna go to, uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Ah, I see. Max bins. One. Done. Custom. Do you want to know what you're allowed to have in, in this thing? Cups. Where, where are those at? Where we got those cups at? Finished good. Mug. I thought, I, th I mean, I thought these goods were in mug. Where, where are these goods in? No, it's not goblet. Well, no, because these were mugs. I told them to, these are labeled as mugs. Which thing are they in? I don't need goblets, I need the mugs. They are goblets. This game needs to fix that. ASA fucking P. You can't be telling me that mugs also are goblets and goblets are mu Mugs and mugs, motherfucker! Okay? Just put it all in your cup then! As a result now, the only finished good not allowed in this place forevermore are goblets. Goblets have been outlawed. Move all goblets to the goblet bin. Someone better take care of it. We struck native copper. Oh wow, that's just everywhere, huh? Huh. How's that mug section going? Better see someone move that over. Better see those mugs get moved, or I swear to God. At the same time, uh, going forward, um, food stockpile. Everything's allowed in here, except I don't want any alcohol in it anymore. So, uh, no more drinks. None. None. All drinks I want downstairs. This is the drink section now. It's where we store all the alcohol in this, in this closet. Yup. Oops. Keep forgetting I have to accept it once I'm done placing it. Accept. Food. Custom. None. Accept. All. And all. Good shit. 
Can't wait for a fire to start in the alcohol zone. Shut up. Oh, man, we move fast, dude. It's way better for, like, dude, this base is so much more functional than the old one. Oh, holy heck. Holy heck, man. Why is there wood down here? Uh, excuse me. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing down here? Fuck out. Cloth bin. Weapon bin. Did we instantly use the bins I made for that fucking mug? Thing? For some bullshit? For all of our cloth? I mean, that's fine. I should probably make more bins. It seems like the dwarves want bins. So I should just make more. But it's just kind of pissing me off. Hang on. All right, we're just gonna, we're just gonna, we're gonna finally do something right by these dwarves. And I'm gonna ask them to make some wooden bins. Make me a bunch of wooden bins. We're gonna make 10 wooden bins. Get that order done. They're happy. Good, good. Elves are lame. Yeah, are we concerned about elves, chat? Are there people here that are actually like fucking worried about the elves? Cause like, <laughs> Cut all these fucking trees down. All right, I want this place. God damn it, there's another hole! Getting kind of sick of finding all these holes. <laughs> I know it's directly as a result of my deforestation, but give me a fucking break. Get it out of here. Get all this shit the heck out of here already. I do the fucking speed at which we haul. Why are my people not happy? Chat, I feel like I've done much for them. As like a, like foreman. I feel I've done much for them. Okay, can we please get one bin moved over here right now? I'm gonna need someone to move that bin over. Before it's too late. Get that bin over there. Can I just designate this as a bin for, uh... I'm gonna designate this as an avocado. Can I designate this as a bin for what I want, which is mugs? It seems I cannot. Just kind of have to hope they figure it out. They fucking immediately put some other bullshit in it. This is a gem bin. All right, go fuck yourself. All right. <laughs> Whatever. I need to make the, uh, militia. I, I've been stalling on that. I think it's time we, uh, get involved in that. Damn, no one wants these stray dogs as pets. I can't believe Stray Idiot is still alive. I mean, I guess I did leave him a beautiful hole to live in. But, like, surprising. It's just in there. Endless food. Ah, uh, yes. We're, we're really... It's all really coming together, chat. And now we can actually start, like, mining things. Got a little too much sandstone. Curious to see. I'm sorry. Do we also have finished good bins now? Oh, good. Good. I'm glad you guys are enjoying using all these bins. Can we get a bin to where... Can we get the, a bin to the bin section? You have bin over there? No? Okay. No bins for the bin section? Fine. Who cares anyways? More tables. Make them all out of the fucking sandstone. Alright. And after you're done with that, I don't want ads. I want uh, thrones. Specifically rock ones. And many of them. Uh, 16 of them. Yeah. Good. Get that shit done. Oh, cool. Yeah, use that bin for, uh, the mugs. Grab that bit. Move that bin to the mug section. How do I make them do it? <laughs> How do I make them put these mugs in the mu in the fucking bin? Guys, you have finished goods in this one. 
Why is that bin not being used? I see a mug right there. Did someone... How'd this even get in here? <laughs> Why? How'd this mug get here? Did they drink out of it? And then... The bin! Beep, 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 beep. Bin is in position. Will they do the next part, though? It doesn't seem like they know to do the next part. It's almost, I'm starting to get worried that the reason why is because the game refuses to acknowledge that those goblets are real. You know what I mean? I'm starting to get worried that the issue is that goblets Wait a minute. This mug is allowed in any and all fucking qualities forever. Okay. Was that what you want me to do, assholes? Still not feeling it? Why is there a hamster in the avocado wood bin? Better be dead in there. You better be dead in there. That's the hamster bin. What? Huh? 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 We did it, baby! All right. Fucking finally. All right, lady. So here's the thing. I want you to make some bone amulets. Uh, I'm gonna just put an order in for it. We got one person who's really good at bone amulets, and I'm actually gonna set them as the bone person. Oh, did they give up? Of course, we don't have any bones. We'll have to collect bones. Can I make like a, you know what I'm gonna do? You know, it's probably like the right way to do this. Uh, Cause we have one person who's like a legendary super bone carver. Literally, their name, their legendary at bone carving. I'm just gonna say that bones are allowed down here, specifically because that's their job forever. Uh, this crafting table is for them to make bone goods. People love bones. I'm gonna have them make bone goods. They're a professional boner. We know this. So while I've typically not allowed corpses, we will allow bones. From here on out, no shells, only bones. Only bones down here. And specifically, one worker is allowed here. And it's the bone carver. Your job, Mezbazuth, is now to carve bones. You will only do what I tell you to do. And at the same time, I've had just about enough of some of these stray animals. These cats aren't interested in owners. Well, now they're going to be turned into legendary bone artifacts. Get the heck out of here. We need food. We don't really need food, but I need bones. <laughs> Unfortunately, I do need bones. Have fun with the hamsters. The cats have never been allowed in the basement. I don't care. Yep. Now that we have these bones. Now that we have bones, I'll put in an order. At the crafting. At the craft dwarf station. I want you to make bone stuff. Make bone crafts. And I want you to do this forever. This is the most important thing our co our community will ever do. I want it done forever. She's doing it! Wait, no, that's a dwarven child. Okay, you gotta start doing something right. You really gotta start doing something. 
They're just bad. She's playing with the bones. What the fuck? Well, they're on their way. There, there they go. Cat bone crown. <laughs> All right. Superior quality. Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> Love that. She made it instantly. That goes in the bit. Jesus, she spit out cat bone stuff like it's nothing. <laughs> Stir. <laughs> Kind of metal as hell. All right. Now this is all cut down here. I do need to make that trade depot. Right here. Pop. Cool. Make it out of whatever we have. Good, good. <laughs> Very nice. The bins were a good call. I think we can all agree. Making those multiple bins. I'll admit, a good decision. It looks like the tables are finally done. How are those thrones doing, though? We have enough beds for everyone, right? We objectively don't. I think at some point I just assumed we had enough beds. Uh, we always need more, too. That's the thing. I'm just going to make another ten of them. I don't care what material you make them in. Just make them. I hate my streamer. Dude, this lady's out here making some crazy shit. This is an exceptional uh, cat bone figurine of dwarves. It's a design of two dwarves in cat bone. Yeah. Dude, we're gonna sell all this cat bone merchandise. We're gonna be fucking rich. This is gonna change the whole game. All right. Uh, so I also want to now extend this, not to the hole, but extend it a little. And I want to make a, like, wood kiln so we can start getting some of this wood processed into charcoal. So I'm going to do that once I've carved this out. Get that dug. You need, car you need charcoal soon. What's this? Oh, they made a masterpiece. See, chat, this is why I'm letting them do this shit, chat. Look at them, they're making- Hey! Don't fucking touch that shit or it's the pit for you! Alright, don't make me seal you into your own tomb like the others. Don't touch that. It's worth more than your life. Actually, for real, get out of there, though. Actually, for real, get out of there. Like, I'm not joking. That's a masterpiece. <laughs> Made out of cat bone. Yes. Why do we have lizard remains? That's garbage. Get it out of here. <laughs> get that out of here. I don't want to see that. All right. So we do have, like, copper and stuff. I'd like to get that all dug out. And then we'll just build walls, I guess, instead. So I'm going to go ahead and just get this copper out of the walls. You don't really want copper in the walls anyways. Get that out of here. There's a hamster in the food. I'm just going to ignore him. Who could have... How could this have happened? Where's every cat that should be dealing with these hamsters for us? You know what I mean? Like, what the fuck? Like, <laughs> fucking help me. You know what I mean? When all the food gets eaten by rats, Tomato will learn his lesson. No, I fucking won't. I fucking won't be. Man, that's a lot of copper. Why, it's still going. Why, it's still going. Why it's still going? Why it's still going? Why it's still go why it's still going? Why imagine it's still going. The copper st it's still going. It's still going. It's still going. It's okay. All right. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, we've reached the limonite. This is not copper. Why, but this part's still going, though. The copper. At last! A treasure worthy of us! Copper! It's still going. An unlimited bounty. What's this? Oh, they finally ran out of bones. That's fine. The amount of cats that had to die for that to be made. Okay, I would also like to put in an order if we could have it done sometime this year. Alright, for some chests. Made out of rock. Unless that's for some reason not possible. It isn't. Okay, then chests made out of wood. I'm gonna want like 14 of those. Rock coffer. Hey, chat. I know that this game has a lot of content in it. And I think it's really cool and all. But can we have some fucking like actual consistency between the names of these items? Can we get, can, like, this game's been out for, like, fucking 20 years? Can we have some consistency between the items? Like, uh, like, everything else is labeled as a chest, including all of the metal pieces, and then the rock one is, like, rock box. Rock little box. And it's just like, man, <laughs> what, you mean a chest? You mean a fucking chest? It was worse before. I don't want to know how much worse it was for you. I don't care about your past. I care about the now, right now. Should have been f milk quartz. The gorilla was here. Uh, do we have any creatures upstairs that I could milk? Hogs. Beep, 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 beep. We got a bunch of hogs coming through. We love, we just fucking love that. Hilk. <laughs> Why have none, like, uh, when are gorillas gonna come through? You know? When are the gorillas gonna get here? Uvash, stop playing near that hole. Stop playing make believe by the hole, Uvash. It's creeping everyone out. You're scaring the people. All right, well, here's the situation. Uh, carpenter's workshop, fishery, tanner shop. Where's my farmer shop? Did I never make one? Oh, I never made one. Oh, no. Well, that's easily solved. I was going to cut out these spots here and put more stuff. I need something that I can use to, uh, skin, or uh, not skin, fucking shear the alpacas we have. Shear animals. If they exist, I want them sheared. Nice. Well, 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 finally out them. About time to make some cash with our legendary bonesmith. We may need more bones for this. Do we have anything we can butcher quickly to spit out some more, uh, stuff? Yo, a stray boar came in! Wait, no, that was our old pig. Nah, the pig's cool. Let's get those bones. Let's get those fucking bones. You know what I mean? Done. Dead. Let's get those bones made. How's idiot? Thriving. Matter of fact, thriving. Having the time of his life. Guys, stop hanging out in the beer cabinet. That's not just for, it's not just for hanging out. I really wish they'd make these fucking things faster. It's 
just like, come on. Like, what the fuck? Masterworks. Horse bone amulet. Whoa, dude. Like, talk shit about what their craft is all you want. They just made a masterpiece horse bone crown. All right, they're, we're cashing out off of this person hard. Every horse we slaughter. Bones immortalized. They should be grateful. Why is this person not having a good time? Oh, I'm sorry. Who are you? Because you're talentless. I feel so good. Unmet need be with family. Who? You don't have family. <laughs> Lady, you don't have one. Literally. You literally only have one friend named Bim. What the fuck? Yeah. It's been unmet forever and will remain unmet. So help me God. Okay. Dude, they're spitting out like 18,000 masterpiece items. They're so good at cutting up horse bone. Holy shit. Dude, what the fuck? Now keep making these fucking horse things forever so long as the stuff is there. Just make bone crafts forever. Seems like it's the best thing we could possibly do for money. Sandstone tables are done. That's good. They made another. They're so good at this. All right. All right, looking good, looking good. Uh, we gotta place the rest of these beds. Should I? Is it about time I start, um... Moving away from the barrack system. Nah, I should make it a little bit longer. There's actually space for like a couple more. Should also make a couple more cabinets. Eh, we'll be okay. We'll be okay. Dig out that. Let's want to get this last row of beds done. All right. We should smooth this place out, make this place look nicer. You know what I mean? But at the same time, no. But at the same time, no. You know what we really need to start doing? Would be really smart for this colony? More so than anything in this world? Uh, digging straight down. To elevation zero. We need to start getting ore. While that's happening. What? Huh? Kaolinite. I knew it. While that's happening, I'm going to add a workshop furnace and a wood furnace right here. Oh no. Chat, elevation zero is not hell. That's sea level, you fucking bozos. You, I think you're thinking of elevation negative 129. I'm cutting down to sea level. We're on a mountain. I'm on a mountain. Opal. Oh yeah, hell yeah. What we need to be worried about is running into, like, some kind of horrifying creature. I do like the notification jingle. There's, like, there is, like, there's horrible monsters uh, that do live down here. Jet. We like jet. Okay, wood furnace. Uh, I am going to put an order in for some uh, charcoal. Uh, let's say 20 charcoal. What's all this? Jet. Part of me also wants to set up like a well. 
But, like, what I'm kind of thinking is, why would I set up a well when I could siphon water from this murky pool? <laughs> when I can set up water from this stagnant pond? For my dwarves to use as, uh, like, you know, hydration and to wash themselves. You know what I mean? Sure, it says stagnant. Sure. If only you had an aquifer. I'd rather- look, chat. Uh, look. Shut up. Shut your goddamn mouth. Lest I shut it for you. How's that tunnel going? Going well, boys, going well. Digging deep, I see, digging deep. Good, good, good. Shouldn't we be getting a uh, caravan coming through soon? While that's happening, I've been postponing this for long enough. We need to sort this out. This is actually like really important. Uh, nobles, we need a militia. We need like, we need guys that are gonna defend us should a creature of the night arise. Does anyone have any relevant skills in running a militia? <clears throat> Uvesh. <laughs> How long are you going to be one? How long are you going to stay one for before you finally grow the fuck up? Alright, I want a child soldier already. You have no talents, but I can mold you into a killer. <laughs> Doesn't that sound fun? Doesn't that sound fun? Hmm. Come on, Uvash. Why can't I set you as a? Why, are, you, are, are they really just too young? Do they just not get it? How how powerful they could become? Euphoric due to inebriation, dude. I yeah, let them drink. If they want to drink, let them drink. What do you fucking want me to say? Wait, I gave you a fucking study, dude. I swear to God, if this isn't set. He couldn't claim it himself. You fucking idiot. People have just been sitting in there. I th every time I've seen someone sitting there, I'm like, oh, he claimed it. He just got it. I don't know why I assumed. Because obviously that's never been the case up until now. But I did. Might be. How's that tunnel going? We're getting there. How's that charcoal going? Looking good. Because we want to make... Is coal bet chat? Is coke better than coal? Like, better... Is it best to make coke before I do anything? It is the only fuel. So charcoal is just to make the coke. Coke is for steel. Well, I'm gonna make some copper. I'm gonna smell all of our copper ore into bars, for starters. Although a grim reminder of the winter hardships to come, the supply caravan from the Rainy Lantern is a welcome sight. Their eyes are alight with anticipation of inspecting the splendid products of your industrious craft dwarves. I can't wait to see what the miners have collected from the depths. And we just come out and it's all bones. We have horse bone, scepters and earrings and crowns for you. This, this m miniature cup I crafted out of the bones of 40 hamsters beneath the surface. You made it to a cavern. All right, then stop. Stop. All water, huh? No ground in this cavern? 
That's what I get for not wanting aquifers. Well, uh, no reason to care about it then. We go around. So I'm going to do is we're going to plug up this. It's so hard to like with my brain connect the dots of like, I need this cavern. Uh, I need this to be moved here. I don't want a stairwell up and like down anymore because I don't want creatures to be able to fly up into here. So, what I want to do is plug up this spot with a floor. This tunnel needs to be covered. I don't want guys to be able to get in here. So, floor there, please. Thank you. And then we just keep digging down. Put this right here. And we go to negative eight. Cool. Good. Hopefully they don't get stuck doing that. Hopefully they don't go to here to do it. Whoa. Oh, they did that fast. Holy shit. Damn, locum, damn. Good shit. I got diplomacy happening. There's people diplomacying me. All right, they're discussing our situation. The world is the same as ever. Make requests for next year's caravan. Yeah, I got something you could give us next time you come here. Okay. We're gonna need uh, lots of, uh, let me see here. I'll tell you what we're gonna need a lot of. Okay. I'll tell you what we're gonna need a lot of. We're gonna need a lot, 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 lot of cages. What? Cages. We need cages. Okay, okay. We're gonna need cages. The hundreds of them. If you think you have enough, you don't. Merchants have arrived and are unloading their goods. Welcome, welcome. How do I trade with them? Now, how do I ma how do I exchange wares with these people now? Ah, I need a broker, don't I? I feel like I'm gonna need a broker. Yeah, I do not have a broker. Oh, fine. I'm gonna have to hire someone so I understand what even the value is of all the things that we made. Fuck it. First things first, it's because they were paused. I need a militia leader. We are going to hire. We'll have Bim do it. All right. Bim's a bow guy. He's probably not going to get killed out there. He knows how to shoot. We'll have Bim be the militia commander. Okay. Now we have one. Who's good at being a broker? Wow, a lot, pretty long sheet of being a novice, huh, Enod? Pretty long sheet just to reveal that you're a novice. I'm gonna have Locum do it because he's a skilled appraiser and I want to know how much money these things are actually worth. And no one else actually knows how to ID what something's value is. So uh, we're gonna have Locum do it. He's the only one that actually came up with the thing you need to do the job. Everyone else was like, I'm a pretty funny guy. I, I'm an, I, I, I can make people laugh. Like, I need someone who knows, like, what things are valued at. I'm gonna have Locum do it. Okay. Now, I'd like to move... How do I... So, I've never traded in this game before. So, the broker's there. He's trading. So I have to move my bins of wood over. 
or uh, bins of bone stuff. Okay, we want to move all these bins full of finished goods up so they can be sold. Get that up there, boys. There they go. Now, I would like to trade. Is that my mug? Oh, that's the mug one. <gasps> no, the mugs! Those are never gonna go back! Those are never gonna get sent back to the right fucking block! <laughs> Fuck me, dude! You know how long it took me to get those bins into the fucking box? Oh. Uh, oh. Uh. Wow, that horse died for some low quality masterwork bone shit. It seems like being a master of making bone goods isn't actually all that impressive. Damn, kind of sad. Anyways, yeah, I'll sell everything in this. I'll definitely sell everything in it. Can I sell it without selling the bin? I really like that bin. Can I sell this without, without going one by, I will just go one by one. I'm not selling them. You don't get to keep the box. I flip it over in front of him. You get to keep all the stuff inside. You don't get to keep the box. Forget it. We're not a charity. Oh, wait. Don't sell these. Those are my splints. This stuff is actually useful. Okay. Okay. I'll trade you all that, but you gotta give me, okay, puzzle box, pass, rooster cage, dog cage, barrels, full of blood, <laughs> cave spider venom barrel, someone's gonna end up drinking that, and I'm gonna look like a fucking idiot. Let's see what else you got. Cheap wool, pigtail seeds, pigtail seeds, plump helmet, spawn bag. I mean, I'll take some of those. I just like having it. Goat leather. Seems like it would be smart to make sure that we have some cloth on hand. Not because I'm going to sell it, but because if someone wants to craft something, like some bullshit. I know I have alpaca wool. I don't have the cloth set up yet. I wouldn't mind just having, like, some shit just in case. Just in case, like, someone wants it. Ilmenite figurine of a moon snail. Pass. Pass on that. Duck meat, no. Plump helmets, no. Leaves, no. Le lots of lo lots of garbage in uh, in this one. Uh, lots of not I did cheese. Okay, Got some cheese. This place was a fun. You guys suck at this. Why does it say they're making an immense profit if I trade them? I, if I press trade, I'm going to make my money, right? I'm, they're not going to get my money. They're not going to get this all for free. They're ripping you off. There is no money. Money doesn't exist. Money's not real. So you're telling me I have to trade him things of equal value. But his stuff of value is trash. All right? I'll trade you silver bars. Okay, I'll trade you some silver fucking bars. How about that? And this rope. And, uh, these cages. I might need those. Uh, I need these for- I need this- I need this for bones. And I need the cages for gorillas. And, you know, I'll also trade you some spider venom. Okay, maybe I'll want that. And some rum. Okay? You know, I'll take a crossbow. I'll take a crossbow. And I'll take a helmet. And you know what? I'll buy the steel pick as well. And to seal the deal, 
Okay, because I'm feeling generous today. I'll take that figurine of a moon snail off your hands and the rest you can take on the house. All right, treat yourself. Even with your combined trade goods, such as they are, I can't fathom you ending up with the items you desire. Fine, you can keep the snail. You'll need more goods to make this arrangement. All I see here is not enough. Really busting my balls on this one. Fine, alright, you can keep the fucking, like, venom. I don't really care. I didn't care about it to begin with, to be frank. Keep the venom and the rum. I don't need it. Actually, no, I do need the rum. Your childish games have made me tired. Perhaps, ne perhaps next time I visit, you'll take this seriously. How about you suck my dick? All right, how about you go to hell? Who the hell? Fuck off! I fuck off then! What? What? <laughs> what? You walked all this way to do nothing? To the hole, dude! Get lost! Come on, guys. Bring this stuff back. Bring all the bring all the stuff back. How do I bring my how do I tell them to take this stuff back? They don't need it. Evidently. Maybe the next trader will like these boxes. Fuck them, dude. What the fuck? How about you go home? No mu Dude, that that was so frustrating. <laughs> I've, uh, never been angrier than I am right now. That really pisses me the fuck off. Traders need to be properly compensated. Well, then next time, how about they do something to earn my goddamn compensation? All right. I think I'm running a goddamn charity here. And do fucking crap. I'm not gonna just pay you a bunch of money to do nothing. Insane. Fucking clowns. How's that ore you're smelting going, buddy? How's that ore? It's looking good. We need more boxes soon, I think. They, the problem is the mugs are gone now. They're drinking out of the goddamn buckets with their bare hands. Like animals. All right, we need to add up. We need to get a militia going. Okay, we need a militia. Oh, we finally got the fungus floors coming in. We can finally, uh, soon we'll be able to move our animals down into the basement where they should be. Good, good. Are we out of spawns? I think we're finally out of plump helmets. I can't believe that person went all this way here and then was like, and I'm done trading with you. Fuck them, dude. Piss off. Hope you fall in the hole. Go to hell then. Hang on, do I have like dimple cups and like stuff like that? Dude, stop. I want to search. We have dimple cups. I'm going to I'm going to grow some dimple cups. You grow some dimple cups this autumn season. Yep. Once this uh fungus grows in, we'll be able to move the animals in. So uh I think I'll just carve out that spot for them now. Should I start setting up floors, though? Wait, why is the fungus upstairs, but never grew downstairs? Oh, well. Oh, God, it's autumn? Yeah, it's getting pretty ridiculous out here already. I think everyone can agree on that. It's getting a little silly. Trust the fungus? Oh, yeah, no, we like the fungus. We're gonna move our animals down here. This <gasps> Lizard! Lizard friend. 
Margaret! Ding, 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 ding. One. Oh, wait, hang on. Who's that guy? Novice Fisherman. Dude, I don't fucking give two shits about you. Your puppy's pretty cool, though. Are there more of you? Hi, Master Fish. Can we get some? Dude, all, we, all we're getting a fisherman. I don't, I don't remember telling people that we were a fishing call. We don't have that much water. It's not like we're like, we are, we, last I checked, we are not, we are not that close to the ocean. Any more? Healthy, talentless. I've been well, no one asked. Next. Talented bone doctor. We have a doctor. <laughs> we have a doctor. We should make a hospital. We, we can make a hospital. Ever heard of freshwater fish? Ever heard of, it's not the problem. The problem isn't that we have like no access to fish. It's that we have too much food and fish. And having 18 fishermen all vying for the same job when they could have been doing something else pisses me off. Anyone else? That's a doctor. Peasant. It's not perfect, but it's good enough. Why fret about it? Okay, well, he's getting drafted. Stukos is getting drafted. <laughs> we do this new thing where people get drafted. Uh, we're not going to use a uniform. The turquoise shocks. Welcome, Stukos. You're officially, uh... You're officially in. Peasants equals fresh recruits. If you don't have talent, alright. I don't know what to fucking tell you. Besmar, novice animal trainer? There's no gorillas here to milk, so who fucking cares? Uh, welcome, Besmar, to Bim's Turquoise Shocks. What else we got? Competent fish cleaner <laughs> and dissector and fish lady. <laughs> Why? They're, they, they're a surgeon too. They're a surgeon too. They're a surgeon too. It's okay. They're a surgeon too. And surgeon. It's just lead with that. Lead with that. Are they a fish surgeon? Are they a surgeon for fish though? Any others? No. Just a little little dog. Oh, there's still another. Stone crafter. Another stone boy. Another? Drafted. Anyone else? That's it. Okay, well, um... Not really many people that, like, grabbed me and really blew me away out there, but hey. You can make this work. Make this work. Fish dwarf for it. It's just a lot of fucking fish dwarves. It's just a lot of fish dwarves. And I don't really think it should be. Extend the hall. We also need more thrones, I think. We're still making them. That's a thing. It might be a case of, like, we truly need more workstations. I know that's the thing we need to care about soon. Sooner or later, that's gonna matter, that's for sure. I would also say that our, uh, you know, our dorm, probably gonna need more space soon. And you know what, maybe I tell all the fishermen that they can go fish, you know? Let them do their thing again. And we'll tell the kitchen that they're going to make fine meals out of it. 
forever. There. Let them fish. Let them do their thing. They'll make really nice meals out of pond turtles. And we'll huck all those turtles into the pit after. Let's set up the rest of the, uh, like, diplomacy crap. Chief Medical Dwarf. Easy. The Doctor. We literally have one. Okay, it seems like what we want to do now is set up a hospital. Now, I'm going to set it up on a floor that's not the main, like, floor here that we've been using. I think it would be good for the hospital to be, like, on this floor on their own kind of setup. You know what I mean? Just have it isolated from the others. We want them distant. A little distant. But, like, in the middle of the station still. Uh, and then we'll have space to expand it. Because I don't know how many dwarves we're eventually going to have. And we have a lot of extra floors here. Um, but first of all, what the fuck does a hospital even consist of? I really wish you could alt-tab out of this fucking game, but it doesn't have a windowed mode. Uh, hospital. I'm going to look it up. Hospital. How do we make one? Okay. Place enough beds in the zone to ensure you can keep all the wounded dwarves in the hospital. Place at least one table for the surgeon to perform surgery on. Place one or more traction benches to handle compound fractures when the dwarves require immobilization. Place containers to store medical supplies reserved for hospital use. Okay. Okay. I get it. I mean borderless windowed mode chat, not fucking windowed mode, because if I had it in borderless windowed mode, people would be fucking freaking out. Am I play like this? No, you don't. You don't. <laughs> you don't want that. Huh? The thrones have finally been completed. Prepare raw fish. Um, let's say you're going to prepare raw fish uh, for 100,000. I want you to prepare 1,000 raw fish. Thanks. And I'd also like... Uh, prepare fine meal 20 for now. O is infinite. Well, I'm sure at a thousand, I'll correct that. <laughs> sure, when the time comes, I'll correct that. They lost all the mugs! Where's the other mugs then? Who knows? They lost them. We don't know where those mugs are anymore. Cannot believe they lost the mugs. Whatever. Uh, this is all garbage, though. Get this, uh, get all that out of here. We're not keeping any of that. Uh, okay. And. Perfect. And then chairs. Lots of space for these dwarves now. They're gonna be happy, aside from the couple that don't have beds. Why is one of them sad? Enod, why am I not fucking surprised? She was upset because she got caught in the rain. She's somewhat focused and she's unfocused at being able to after being unable to acquire something. What's your fucking problem? She's just thinking about it. It's making a mat. All right. Time to make a place that's sterile. Actually, 
need longer. Make this a medical closet kind of thing. Bada bing. Good. Does the chief medical director need an office? No. Dig that. Dig all of it. So the copper bars are coming together. I want to start making us actual like weapons and armor. I want to start doing that, among other things. I also need to expand the ever-growing barracks that people I think hate. I think they hate the barracks, but I'm not changing my ways. The barracks remain ever expanding. Ever expanding, it will continue to be forever. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cut this spot out here now. Cause in a bit of time, that's just gonna be where we keep the animals. I'm gonna go ahead and also do this. Can I shrink the stockpile? There we go. Just want to cut this back one line. Huh? Enith Ashman Ficot is in a f has been taken by a fey mood. They're not drinking anything. Zolben Asmelberil has grown to become a cat. Oh, okay. I thought a dwarf did that, and I was like, damn. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what's up, Zolben? <laughs> okay. Uh, where is, uh, what's up with, uh, Enith? Did you climb inside that barrel, Enith? I feel so good. Well, what do you, uh, what do you need, man? How do I know what he needs for his thing? For his, like, strange mood. Click the workshop. Oh, I guess I gotta let him go somewhere first. He's claimed a stoneworker's workshop. Okay. Well, what do you, uh, what do you want? He's, he's got what he wants. He already has what he wants. He wanted sandstone. He's been looking around at sandstone. What's he making? Enoth, you're the expedition leader. What are you doing? He's furiously working on something. I do want to remind everyone, he has never, he's barely even done anything involving stonework in his entire life. He doesn't know where he is. He's not good at this. He's really not. He's not, cr he's not creative. Really? Um, he's not, he's literally not creative. But he's got, he's got, he's got a fey mood. But what is he making? But what? Go, Enith. Create the first legendary artifact of our people. And while you're doing that, I'm just gonna, like, get distracted doing other stuff. Uh, cause we really need, like, armor. I guess metalsmith is also armor. Yeah. I want to start making like clothes for like a, for the militia. How many people are in that squad? Who's part of my, we got four people. Let's start getting that done. Uh, I'm going to order a couple hats to be made. <laughs> we need helmets for these boys. 
Copper helm, make four of them. For starters. Enith, how's that going, man? Enith, how's that? How's the stone thing going, man? How long is this going to take? Because, uh, I'm worried about him, man. I'm worried about him. Also, I just want to confirm this. How, where do we live again? Oh, right here? Wait, where am I? Eh, who cares? I was going to check how far away I was from the ocean. <laughs> Enith, what's up? He's speaking to God. Oh, I don't have all day to care about him. All right. Enith, Ashman Fikad, expedition leader, has created Delith Othud, a sandstone table. Oh. Cool table, man. Uh, I guess we'll swap your old table for that one. He offers it to the syrup of strategy. Who? This is a sandstone table. All craft's dwarf ship is of the highest quality. On the item is an image of the first path of the moon. Then, the world. The red squirrel parchment scroll. In, stand, in sandstone. What? Who? Who? What? Red squirrel parchment? You made your first artifact inspired by a red squirrel? He better be good at making stuff out of stone now, I'll tell you what, Enith. Oh! It's him! And thus, Enith became the greatest miner of our people. The polish of morality. Epic, man. Now get back to work, okay? Get back to fucking work. You've been hugging the goddamn station all day. Get back to work. Now. <laughs> Now, Enith, you know how much shit we have to mine? What have you been up to all day? Drinking? Who's the pissy asshole that's not doing anything? Oh, you can do other stuff. No, we don't have any bones for you. Uh, where are you? Enod. Fucking Enod, dude. Fucking Enod. Wait. Forge Copper Helm. Oh, this work order has not been validated because our manager is, uh, was having a psycho experience. So he couldn't validate the work order. <laughs> no nothing was getting done for a while because Enith was busy, like, frothing at the mouth making tables. Well, it's worth about a thousand bucks. Man, that guy that declined to, like, buy stuff from us last time sure does have some egg on his face now, because we just made a legendary fucking table. All right, I don't know what else to say. We just made a legendary table. Most people die before they ever see a table that strong and powerful. Okay, so here's the situation. <laughs> We're going to let this fucking fungus grow in. Once it does, we're going to move all the animals down here into this bin. And then we're going to forget about them. And we're never going to go back to the surface ever again. Okay? We, uh, milk some animals. Yeah? Can we also make some cheese when we're done with that? Yeah? Can we also shear these animals, please? Yeah? Can we also spin some thread, please? Yeah? Get to it? Are the mugs still at the depot? I'm trying to think about it. What do you think? Just gonna make more mugs. Yo, Enith, are you going to do your job? 
Or did you think that- Oh, he's digging. Dude, do, do your job. You need to- You're the manager, man! I'm gonna fire him and get a new manager. That's it. Sorry, Enith. If you're not gonna do your job, I'll replace you. Besides, there's probably someone better at logistics at this point. He's not doing it. I need someone to do that job. So, you're fired. Uh... No one's very good at it. But you know what? Uh... We have a lot of... We have Be Besmar. No, we don't want someone that's gonna die. Locum can do it. He's already the broker. He doesn't have much else going on. Locum, you do it. Enith, he'll be fine. We're gonna give him the- We're gonna give him Enith's old office. You're not gonna do the job. Get the fuck out of here, you know what I mean? Like, I don't really have time. There. If Enith has any problems with that, he can go to hell. He doesn't. He doesn't care. He doesn't care. He's already- he's riding high. Okay, I'm gonna put it in order. Once they verify this, which I'm sure they fucking will any minute now if they know it's good for them, if they want to keep this fucking job. Uh, I'm gonna put in order for some new mugs. Ten of them. Better see someone going to that office to verify these orders. That's what I want- that's what I like to fucking see. Someone's actually doing their goddamn job. Good. What's this? Good. Got some more beds down. I'm gonna keep working on the hospital after this. Okay. Hospital's been cleared. For this to happen, I'm going to need to order, I would say, I'm going to say eight beds. I'd like them all to be the same thing, but we don't have that much. We need to chop down more wood. Uh, actually, I cancel this then. Uh, let's go up to the surface and chop down some more trees. Yeah, the elves will probably find this problematic, but I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. I didn't ask. Oh, there we go. Okay. Armor's starting to get done. Took a while, but we finally got there. Something has collapsed on the surface. What happened? Oh fuck, the puppy fell down the hole, dude! They're annoyed after choking on dust. Oh, they're okay. I mean, they're in a pool of their own blood, but apparently they're okay. Be more careful with where we cut these fucking trees. Wait, why are they- Avocado wood log strikes the puppy in the left front leg. An injured part is smashed into the body in unrecognizable mass. An artery has been opened. Is this dog good? Because <laughs> they made it sound like he was good. He looks good. He's just got a slight injury. They're fine. There you go. They're good. Cool. Cool. I mean, I'm going to have to cover up that fucking zen. I'm not gonna do it till everything's done. Look, they just took a little tumble. God, these trees are fucking violent, dude. Okay, so that's all open space. That needs to be fixed. This might be open. This guy's a lot of open space. At what point do I just pave the fucking surface? At a certain point, I really do just have to pave it. Pave it all over. There we 
we go. All right. These animals are almost ready to be ferried downstairs. Let's get these walls done. I need to box them in. Wait, no, I don't. They're animals. They're not going to do anything crazy. They're just animals. Uh, all right. Uh, new zone. Pen slash pasture. Do they need a water source? Uh, I don't think animals do. Some animals need to graze, but no water. That's the point of the sparse. That's the point of the floor fungus. Floor fungus fills that need. All of you are moving here, except for you, stray idiot. You stay in your box where you belong. Yep. We are officially free of the surface. As of now. We don't go up there anymore. Aside from to throw out our garbage in the stray idiot hole. Can't wait till someone falls in the pit. I don't- I dare not tamper with the uh, current setup we've got going. Let's make another big old pile of stuff. Back to plump helmets. See, these animals are having the time of their life. Snacking on this and blood. They're having a good time. Okay. Hospital's getting cleared. We don't have any medical supplies, so I have nothing to de- I have nothing to put there. But, uh... Yeah, now that I've got those beds, let's put in the order for the beds. Eight of them. Let's put in an order for some tables. Out of rock. Yeah, that'll be nice and comfy. I'm sure the, uh... I'm sure they'll be thrilled about that. We'll make uh, four tables. And what the fuck is the other thing I need to build? I have it over here. What the hell was the name of it? Traction benches. Make me uh, one or two traction benches, please. For when my characters get uh, violently maimed. Thank you. Thank you. All right. I guess we should also make doors. We don't really want this place to get, uh, like, absolutely raided. Nah, who cares? That's what the hatch is for. We're getting a little bit of a situation where there's not much more space for things. I either need I need to throw out some of my garbage. We got, some, we got a bunch of rocks I don't really care about. Let's clear out some of these. We use sandstone for most things, so. If it ain't sandstone, I don't really care. Clear some of it. More bins? Yeah, I know, but that doesn't handle the rocks. But yeah, I should get a bin. I should get more bins. That I do agree with. Now that I know... How powerful bins are. And we do have all these copper bars that aren't being used. Alright, next order is... I need copper armor. Copper breastplate. We're gonna really kit these guys out. Four copper breastplate. And then, uh, battle axes, okay? Copper. I'm only gonna make three of these though because uh, one of the guys is getting a crossbow. Add a copper instead, because he's a, he's a ranged boy. Our boy's a ranged boy. The uh, leader of the militia. All right, we'll set up their uniforms after this. Very nice, very nice. Stuff's coming along much better than the old place. 
We can all agree on that, I think. All the dwarves are... Eh, uh, Happiness-wise, and that's okay. There's... Lots of fucking rotten rats. I don't know why no one... Has cared about that so far. It's, it's garbage. Put those out of there. Boys. Mugs are taken care of. Now, uh... I got a question that I would say is really important. Uh, what was that? I literally forgot what my question was. Uh, why are my drinks not? Why, where, are we still cooking drinks? We are. Okay. I was wondering because my drinks are very low and they shouldn't be. The hole is still there? Of course the hole's still there. Why would the hole not still be there? Okay, this is all going really well. I'm really happy with how this base is turning out. Though I'm going to be frank about something. We need more bones. We need more bone goods. That's where we get most of our money. We're going to need more fucking bones, man. No one's come to fuck with us, which is good because I am not done making like weapons. Why are there still tables being made? Oh yeah, for the uh for the hospital. Are we done with the beds too? We are, we are. Very good. Alright, let's spit out this hospital before I forget why I'm making it over and over again. Hospital might have made it a little too big. <laughs> to be honest, I think I made it a little big. I also didn't really make it at the right scale. Oh my god, that's going to drive me fucking crazy. Uh, cancel all of it. Cancel the whole thing. Cancel all of them. I gotta format this differently. I'm not resizing it, I'll tell you what. There. Give these boys plenty of space. They're going to need it after all the horrible accidents they've endured. They're going to need it. They're going to need that space. And then, okay, here's what we do. <laughs> we really, we really got to drop this. Uh, we got to move this burrow. We're going to want to move this burrow now and actually label it properly. The hospital scheme was funny. But the only hospital's there. This. Legally not hospital. Okay, table. This will be the operating room. And one of the nicest tables we have in the entire building will be here as well. Never, never mind. Maybe it's that one. It's probably the one this guy's moving really slowly. Ne never mind. No one touches that. I, we lost that table. Oh, th no, it's this one. Someone's going to get operated on and die on Delith Alund. Or, or, or uh, Delith Athud. And that's really fun for them. Ain't that something? Why is the traction bench not been finished yet? Is it a mechanism? Oh, please fucking tell me it's not. Oh, God. I was worried this would happen. I was worried this would happen. I have to make it at a mechanism mechanic table, don't I? Or some bullshit. What table are these made at? Hmm. Let me ask the wiki. It won't let me leave to ask. I just locked my mouse in the game this time. I am trapped in here. Whatever. Uh, fine. I was gonna make one anyways. Fine! We'll add another row of bullshit.
about time anyways. We need more stuff. We're gonna expand the whole operation. Look at how fast he fucking mines, though, this boy. Look at how fast he mines, though, this boy, dude. Alright. Uh, what else do I want? I mean, I would take a... Siege thing. I don't think I want that. I don't think we need that. But I would take another, uh... Mm. Double the stone working seems good. Soap? No, no. Screw press. No, that's smaller. Now I'll just have that there. Does this make what I need? Traction bench. Yeah, so now someone can actually do that. Cool. It's already ordered, too. Expand this. Good, good. This is really all coming together, chat. I mean, yeah, I haven't smoothed this place or made it look nice at all. Yes, I could. I would even argue that I should. I'm gonna clean up the barracks so that they all think it's really nice instead of disgusting as they've gone to assume up until now. I'm gonna like do some stuff here. Hang on. Construction, wall. Uh, we wanna make it all out of sandstone. Good. Now, please smooth the rest of it. Good, good. And all the floors. Let's make this place look nice so that people will stop whining. You guys, yeah, you all live in the same box, but like, <laughs> it's, all, it's a nice box. It's fucking nice. Look at that, look at that teamwork. Did they do that classic RimWorld like bullshit where they fucked up building the wall properly and now I have to deconstruct part of it to finish it for them? That's really fun. So, uh, deconstruct that for me? Everyone's doing this. Everyone pitches in when I want the room smooth. Everyone wants the room fucking smooth. All right. We're running out of alcohol. Why? The plump helmets are growing, but we got so many people that want alcohol now, dude, and it's pissing me off. Oh, there we go. Did someone finish building this now? Finish that. God, look at that. The barracks look so much nicer. They should be thanking me. What is this? Oh yeah, this place is legally a hospital now. Hang on, I gotta... Just add those traction benches. They should be done. Why are the traction benches not done? I'm sorry. You just take a sandstone... Why does this fortress resemble a dick? Nice fucking try, dude. Nice fucking try. You're not gonna catch me out like that. Make the traction bench. Is this guy a buffoon? Someone's walked up here four times, tried to make a traction bench, and then changed their mind. What are you missing? Needs refined coal to make the cut. We need mechanisms to make the traction bench. And we need refined coal to make much of anything else. Which means I gotta go back up here. I knew we were gonna run out of coal eventually. First, we need to make charcoal. Gonna make another 20 of this stuff. Do I also need bituminous coal? Because I'm pretty sure I have charcoal. No, we're out of charcoal. 
We have bituminous coal. And then I need to make coke for refined coal, I think. From bituminous coal. Make ten of them. Do it. Ship it. Now. Get it done. It's been quiet, dude. We've yet to really be threatened by any creatures. We've yet to be actually in danger. It's been quiet. Why does no one want to do jobs? And why is no one finishing this? Resume construction. Fucking idiots. Keep up. Why are you disrespecting my exact instructions? So I finish this wall? There they go. They're meeting. I don't remember calling a meeting. <laughs> I don't remember calling no meeting. I woulda. If you guys have time to meet, you got time to smooth these walls. Okay? You got time to meet, you got time to smooth walls. It's just like, I vaguely remember doing literally everything I could to farm. And we're just kind of waiting for those to come in. Until they do. Oh, wait, hang on. Uh, this is the most important job you could ever have in my in my society and i'm actually going to expand the farm uh out we're going to make it larger we're going to make multiple sections for multiple kinds of like plants it's time to it's time to expand the process Hey man, you gotta finish that alcohol. All right, you gotta finish the alcohol. We are running out of alcohol. I'm gonna go ahead and just put a work order in that from now on, brew drinks from plant infinitely forever. If there's a drink to brew from a plant, I want it brewed. It's the most important job in the entire thing. Nothing else is more important than brewing a drink from a plant. Forever, that's it. How's that smoothing coming? Oh, I gotta make... Is the mechanisms done? Okay, traction... Damn, nice traction bench. What the fuck? Superior quality traction bench. Damn, man. Look at that smooth. Now, would you look at the quality of that craftsmanship? Look at them go. What do you guys think of the new area? They're having the time of their lives now. This place is all smooth. Traction bench, what does it do? Keep you straight. Alright, because we don't want people bending their backs and stuff. When they get shattered by a giant toad. As tends to happen in the basement, evidently. Hang on, I gotta make this place more compact and miserable. Do we start getting involved in, like... Do we get, like, involved in, I don't know... Making, like, personalized... Is that, who is that? Uvash! Get old already! Gee, dabbling planter! Hang on, they're already they're getting skills. They're getting skills. They're getting there, they're getting there, they're getting there, they're getting there. They're really getting there, Chad, it's happening. They're evolving. How's, uh... How are you doing? Dude, we're getting a little collection of bugs down here now. We're getting a little collection of guys down there now. Ain't that just something? No, I'm also going to put an order in to always uh, shear animals infinitely. 
If it's available, do it. We want that wool. I'm also going to put another order in to always milk animals. Forever. Do it. If it's available. No, we can't get Gilk. There's no, tw there's no fucking gorillas so far. I mean, I can check. Oh. The Wolverine. To my knowledge, Wolverines don't drop milk. To my knowledge, Wolverines do not drop milk. Okay, farming, farm plot, bada bing. Building present. What do you mean? Oh, okay. Okay. And then one last section. I really just want to make sure that, like, everything is just, like, there's always something being grown and planted over here forever. Get it done. Good. Good. The great farmlands. And the animals are having the time of their life. Everyone's having a good time. All right, you plant plump helmets. Set these to fertilize every season. You're all gonna plant plump helmets right now. I really wish someone would clean up this blood. That's still blocking part of the screen. It's just blood here. Are you gonna hold power over the Gilk Monopoly? There is no Gilk Monopoly because there's no Gilk. How am I supposed to hold like Monopoly over something that doesn't exist? Dude, you gotta be kidding me. The traction bench isn't done. Why is it not done? Is it done now? Can't milk animal. No bucket. It's always something with these fucking people. All right. Bucket. Fine. We'll make some wooden buckets and stop making ads. Fine, make buckets. I'd also like to put in another order since we have enough people and I know we can. Cut gems. And I want you to do it. Forever. Someone's gotta become a good gem cutter. Someone making jewelry. Forever. Everyone's starting to get their forever jobs. It brings a tear to my eye. It brings a tear to my eye to finally have people having jobs forever until they die. Doesn't that just... Doesn't that just bring a smile to your face? To know that someone's been destined to a job until they die, till the end of their life, forever. That fucking... Traction bench. Why is it not done? It's because we're missing a table now, aren't we? There's always something missing. Let me guess. It's the table this time. We need more tables. Someone used the other table somehow. Somehow a table went missing. How's alcohol doing? Only 30 drinks. That's not what we like to see. We need more than that. We need way more than that. No new migrants in a while either. It's like people are afraid to move here. Okay, well... Once that other traction bench is done, I'll... Is it done? What is this? 
No one to shear, no one to milk. All right, fine. Okay, well, uh, we got a lot of coke now, which means I should be able to make the armor, right? It's hard to tell because it's all inside the barrels now. Copper breastplate. Okay, we've got three copper breastplates. What kind of quality is this? This object is heavily worn. You're telling me they made shit ones? It doesn't matter. Fine. Spit it out. Make it. All right, boys. So here's the situation. You guys got a new uniform. The turquoise shocks has a uniform. And it's going to be metal armor. Specifically. Hang on. We'll make it ourselves. New bodywear. Breastplates. New headwear. Helms. Good. Good. Uh, it seems... Can I... I can tell someone to wear their own unique kit, right? Like, I don't need everyone to be wearing the same thing. Partial match is okay. Confirm. So now they'll try to get the helmets and the clothes. If they can't get it, that's okay. Uh, I also, can I edit the uniform? Is there a way to edit a uniform that already exists? Chat, how do I, how do I go in and edit it now? I need to, I want to change something in it. Don't think so. That's wildly upsetting. Okay, breastplate. Helm. And battle axe. And if we can, uh, shield slash bucklers. Good. Partial match is okay. Shock two. Save. Will they actually go get it if I immobilize them now? I don't know if they will. Maybe now. Oh, there they go. No, I'm not seeing it. Or else Sotal would be wearing something. Guys, I know we own armor. And I know we own helmets. Or maybe they're already wearing them? What's this? He made a masterpiece custard apple wood bucket. It's just so like, oh boy, dude, when you want them to do something really specific, it's maddening. There's no reason Stukos shouldn't be wearing a helmet. So if I find them and check, they better be wearing one. They're not. Well, where is it? Because I know that it's not in the stock anymore. I checked. Literally, the helmets are gone. So... Uh? Uh? They're gone! I know I made them! I guess I don't care about uniforms then. I'm not gonna spend all this time trying to make them if they're gonna fucking get, like, disappear. Like, I'm just not going to do that. I don't care. If they're in the trade depot, do you still see them? The chat, they're not in the trade depot. 
I'm just I'm just not gonna I'm just not gonna fuck with that then. Fine, I don't care. We'll worry about mobilizing the squad when someone attacks us. <laughs> No, I don't have a bookkeeper yet. But I'm not gonna overthink that crap and try to hunt down something that I may never find. I just don't care enough. Uh, cool. Someone's making- Who's- What is Lolar up to? Who is this guy? This is a guy that's making some crazy stuff. He's made like two, like, masterpiece items. They're only accomplished. This person's good with making fucking wood stuff. Holy shit. Not bad, man. Not bad. Alright, I think it's time to go deeper into the depths of the darkest hole. Chat, look, here's the deal. Okay. I want to be fucking rich. I'm telling them to take us even deeper. Negative 50. Descend. We will find adamantine. So help me God, we will find mithril in these mines. Have we finished that? We be if I swear to God, if we're not done with this fucking traction bench. Okay, good. All right. So this is now a meeting area. Except specifically a new hospital. Very good. We have a chief doctor already. Good. Good, good, good. Good, 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 good. Who the hell's this guy? Oh, it was just them placing the thing. Who the hell's this guy? Oh, there he is. Perfect. People are just having a good time now. We're descending. We're going even deeper. Did someone just fall into the hole? I thought I saw a dwarf over here. I really thought someone fell. Just waiting for it to say we've struck uh, adamantine or something epic, you know what I mean? Any minute now, we're gonna find something of real value. Tetrahydrite, pyrite. Pyrite. A Ushe Astotong has become a dog. Okay. Horn blend, don't care. Praise cluster. Well, that's negative 50. And nothing bad happened. So, chat, that means it's time to dig down to negative 100. And then, we will build our legacy. Then we will build our legacy. Only then will we have what we were destined to have. Deeper. And we're going to be watching this because I want to tell me if anything really good comes out. It needs empty food storage. Copy that. Barrels inbound. More barrels inbound. Copy that. Man, imagine not having like the sound ping mod, dude. Holy shit. It's like the most helpful thing in the whole game. All right. What's this? Kimberlite. We're getting even deeper now. Deeper still. Deeper still. Still even more deeper. Go! 
That's gold, baby! That's gold! We're rich! We're rich! Gold in these here hills! Gold! But yet I will go even deeper still. But yet I desire even more. Discovered it. Wow, we're on the ground floor, huh? Stop! The fuck are those? Guys, there's no really, there's really no need to go any deeper now. Any deeper would be... It. But uh, what I'm gonna do instead is construct a wall. Right here. And a... Put an order for a door. Right now. Made out of the finest copper. Only one of them. If copper, everyone knows. Everyone knows it for its strength. Just get to a hundred. Good. 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 Don't go out there. Finish that. And then finish the door. And then we're gonna actually make it illegal to go out here. Wait for it to ping me. I'm gonna make it illegal to go out here for now. Secure this tunnel. Essentially is all I want to do. We're gonna use this place as a farm, but I mean, there's monsters in it. There's literally creatures. Uh, all I want to do right now... Although it is... Chat, this is a very... This is a one level... Like, cavern. I could easily secure this with walls. This is like actually super securable. Like, I'm going to, I think... Yeah, this spot right here? That's seeming like it. That's seeming like the call. Prime Foreman. Just waiting for that there, uh... Waiting for that door to finish. Hey, where's my fucking manager at, you know? Like, oh, sleeping? Oh, locum, we let you sleep now, huh? I didn't realize that was a thing we let you do. I didn't realize you wanted to get a new job. I didn't realize you wanted to get fired. What the fuck is a hammerer? Chat, do I need to, like... Chat, is it about time we get into prisons? You know what I mean? Should I be getting... Should I be... Should I be getting a, a police officer soon? The fuck is that thing? Creepy crawlers. They're everywhere. The sooner we get that door done, the better. Where's that, uh, magma pool, though, that I was hearing so much about? Door done? Door done, door done, door done. Cool. Finish it. And then it's time to gather gold. Incredible amounts of gold. Yes. Yes. We're gonna be rich. Okay, so that door should be secured after this. Shouldn't have to worry about that anymore. 
Uh, wow, we're actually like starting to burn through resources. I mean, which is good. I want you to make. I'm going to put an order here, something I know you'll be able to do, so obviously don't worry about that. I want you to make a thousand gold bars. What? Gold rose bars is not the same as gold. Do I not need to make gold into anything other than what I want to make it into? Do I not need to process that in any way? Ah, smelt native gold ore. I'd like to ask you to do this forever. Thank you. Thank you, very good. Very good. Hey, Uvar, stop playing by the fucking drinks. Why are you a dabbling milker? <laughs> I guess they've just been getting there faster than everyone else to milk the alpacas. They've just been running right to it. Oh, we can't have you here on the farm plot, buddy. Have all the creepy crawlers come crawling upstairs to infest my house? Is the wall- is the fucking door done yet? You actually need to like arm someone as like the exterminator. Can we get the door done? You better be carrying a door. Troll, 371 years old, disdains harmony, values eloquence, has empathy, good intuition, very private. No official position. He has a great sense of empathy, great intuition, very good focus and good kinesthetic sense, but he has a questionable spatial sense, a large deficit of willpower and little natural inclination towards music. He can't- he personally can't fathom why anyone would want to live in an orderly and harmonious society. Deeply respects eloquent speakers and finds those who deny their impulses somewhat stiff. Can we please... Fuck it, I don't know. Can we like, I don't know, kill these guys? Can we like, I don't know, talk it out with them? I'll talk it out with them once I confirm that the door is closed. Cause this troll is currently sprinting upstairs as fast as he fucking can. I lost sight of him. Where the fuck is he? There's like so much fucking shit in this cave. All I want them to do is seal it. But like... We're just not good at that kind of stuff. Alright, it's done. Where's that troll at? <laughs> Where's the troll? He's... He He's running away from the cave. Also, secondary question, was he just allowed to open the hatches? I guess he just wanted to be free. He was stuck in a cave for 400 years. He gets, he just ran out. They weren't locked. They were supposed to be locked to people that aren't us. That was what I wanted. Well, Mr. Troll. Guess get out there and live your best life, guy. Is that a fucking tiger? Oh, he fucked off too. Why can't I find a gorilla? I just want some gilk.
I mean, everyone had, like, chat, honestly, looking at the stats, it looks like almost everyone in the colony had a big smile on their face because they were like, get the hell out there, little guy. Your time is now. They're all, like, really happy. Maybe I should have captured that troll and gotten, like, troll milk instead. Maybe that should have been the play, because, like, really... Really... Forbidden Trilk. <laughs> Shut up! Ugh. But you're not wrong. But everyone can agree on one thing. You're not wrong. Okay. Well, hey. What I need to do now is forbid this area from ever being traversed by humans again. Have we obtained all the gold? Almost. Okay, so this is illegal. Don't go out there, guys. Right now, the only things out here are creatures. Horrible creatures. And really, we don't want to fuck with that. We really don't. Although, it would be really good to have that farmland. It would be really good. Look, here's the thing, chat. And this is the only thing I'm thinking about. Wait, what happened to those creepy crawlies? Hang on, I'll back up to the surface. There was a point where there was a bunch of creepy crawlies crawling around. They were here. I'm not seeing them now. Maybe they all left. I had to cut down more trees. You can make an indoor farm. Did you really just say that to me? Did you, did you really? At this point in the game? Did you? He's not wrong. He's not wrong. Yeah, no, he's not wrong. No one was. Uh, no one's objecting to that at all. He's really not wrong. You're right. You're right. You're right. True. Chat, the thing is, could we get even deeper? I don't think so. I think we've reached, like, the depth of, like, as far as you can go. Is that native platinum? Holy shit, dude. We've reached, like, the ore zone, man. Hang on. This changes everything. We've reached, like, the zone where we get loot. I wonder if there's a way I can just, like, vein mine. Oh, hold up. Well, that will only mine stuff that's visible. We'll see. Maybe it'll smart up. Maybe it'll smarten up as time goes on. Watch this. Enod's become a woodcutter. Well, the good news is sorting out the farm thing and then setting it up to permanently forever process these drinks has made our lives a lot easier. Uh, I'm still worried about our current militia, but... The best defense is keeping our houses sealed forever. You know what I mean? Wow, he's really going for it for this platinum. Holy shit. Holy fuck. Damn, Enith. Well, we're getting a lot of platinum out of this. Holy shit. You missed some, you fucking fool. Hey, idiot. You missed some. Get that too. And the gold. All of it. If only it was worth a lot. All gems, all same value, correct? I don't think that's true. One. 
And two, I'm pretty sure platinum can be used to like make armor and like weapons and stuff rather than just gems. Pretty sure there's more to it than that. Or this game would not have much reason for you to even dig down more than one uh, level. Oh, hell yeah. Look at all this gold, Chad. Look at all this gold. I'm going to also tell him to get this, though. Damn, this changes everything. I thought I told you to vein mine. Get back over there. Good. Now, that was a lot of mining. Okay. It's time. They're already smelting. I don't know if they're actually doing it or not, but I'm also going to tell them to smelt native platinum ore. Same thing. Infinitely, forever. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. What do my people need more than anything in this world? Law! <laughs> they need law! No one knows how. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, a bookkeeper? Could have messed those do it. He could, um, we just need to make him a study. Which is definitely doable. We can put it right next to the other study. This is the office section. Take that out, please. And uh, while we're at that, can we also smooth all this out, please? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, what the fuck? This is supposed to be the nice part of the town. Uh, no door. We need to make everything for this fuck. Uh, I'm just gonna do it here. Door. Rock. We'll make it out of Gabro. Door. Table. We already have tables, actually. But I'd like it all to be matching, actually. Table. Air to Gabro. And. Throne. Air to Gabro. Can we embed platinum into the floors? Well, it's not like we could use it for weapons. No one knows how to pick them up. <laughs> so I'd say the world's our oyster on those. No one knows how to pick up anything. We're really just like, really, if push comes to shove, we're dead in a fight. They don't know how to, they don't know how to defend ourselves or anything. But I'll tell you what we do know how to do. I don't know. Make a... I don't know. Pray to God? To make a church? Temple? Yeah, I can make a temple. I can also make a tavern. Man, I actually do need to expand this. Uh, we could, we could pray to God. We don't have enough drinks for a tavern, chat. I don't want anyone going into a tavern. We don't have enough fucking drinks for something like that. But we could get everyone praying to God. Okay. I think everyone could use some God in their life. Maybe it'd make them stop questioning why they live in squalor. Yeah, why do we have people pray to God more often? Yeah, yeah, we can do that. How, uh, now what is, what does a temple consist of? I gonna have to make anything special for this. I'm gonna have to make some bullshit. Oh. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. What the? Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Fucking. What? Temples just need high value. So you're telling me all I gotta do for that temple is take the really nice table out and put it in that temple and I win? My $1,000 table?
Oh, hey, that stray mule is like now fully grown little guy. Well, not really. All right, I need one to use bones. Who's it gonna be? Whoever stumbles onto my cursor. Big fucking misplay, stray buck rabbit. Big fucking misplay. Big misplay. We need those bones. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Make bone crafts forever. Dead. I care not about the rabbit. That's cool. Congratulations. Oh, what's this? Zuntir Genomnaban. The metal crafter has been possessed. Well, where are they at? I- they- they, they just locked onto a fucking rock on the ground. Oh... Uh, where's this guy at? Zuntir. Oh, this is them. I'm following them. They're saying they've been well. But they've got a kind of situation on their hands. We're gonna see what... They want to make something. They're getting gold! Yes. Centier needs, needs bones and bars of metal. Blocks and bricks? Okay. Uh, I can get you blocks. What kind of blocks are you looking for? Uh, we got, uh... They got Gabbro. Uh... Make it a Gabbro. We got a lot of Gabbro right now. Uh, I don't know about the bricks thing. I don't even see bricks. I think that's just some bullshit. Um, but if you want, we're me we're smelting the ore. That's happening. So don't you worry about that. Although if you need more, you might have to make more like charcoal first. May have to do that first for them. I think we might need more charcoal. Because I gotta put in the order for more charcoal. Probably need to make more charcoal. We usually do. Everyone li everyone's really liking hanging out in the hospital. And I do not think there's a reason. Other than everyone really likes hanging out in the hospital. Hmm. Well. Currently they need blocks or bricks and bones. Which kind of creature in our farm do you think would provide the most ideal bones? I'm gonna actually disable this again while I do this. Horse? No. No, we've already seen the value of those bones. It was not ideal. Swine. Swine bones. Squeeze swine bones. Crundles? What are crundles? <laughs> I, the door is locked. They can't get in. But what are crundles, though? Explain. Can I get, like, a description? A tiny underground monster with large claws and horns. It walks on two legs. It's dangerous when encountered in large numbers. It is rarely sick. You're gonna get crundled, bro. The door is locked. Idiots. Morons. Fools. Nincompoops. Try getting in. You can't. Because the door's locked. You just walk in.
Can we get this shit fucking done? My boy needs... There's an, there's actual creepy crawlies all over the... Can we get... Hey, guys. Uh, mobilize. Routine off-duty. More like get on duty. All right, equip yourselves. With some stuff. Grab your battle axes. Okay. Of any kind. How many times am I going to have to fucking punch in this mission for them? Breastplate. Don't care. And headwear. Partial matches are okay. Please. Save. Get it. You're on shift, okay, because I need to fucking- I'm sending out a kill order on this creepy crawly. Okay, you actually can't. Apparently these guys are not something you can- Hang on. I think this thing got confused by, like, me. Kill order. Okay, these creepy crawlers you can't fight, huh? They're a little too small. They're just little guys. Okay, as long as they're just little guys, I don't care. As long as they remain little guys. If they're just bug-style creatures, I don't care. Just stay little guys. Don't come at me. Can we please... make more charcoal? Whoever's supposed to be making this order, they're not doing it, so I'm gonna have to force it, because we need this done. Until then, I don't think this person's life continues. Has the pig been slaughtered? Hang on. The pig's not been slaughtered. The swine has not been slaughtered. I don't think I put in the order. Oh, I was distracted by the crundles. Of course. I was distracted for, by the crundles. Can we get that pig out of here? Yeah, take him to the take him to the slaughterhouse. Don't get distracted by the crundles. Wait. Oh, are they going to get more stuff? They're grabbing the bones. They've they've claimed the bones already. Oh, are they done? They keep muttering Shago Gadash. Dude, take it easy, man. You're acting like a psycho. Okay, so we can tell him to stop doing the forced charcoal cook then. Good. Dude, he just keeps chanting Shago Gadash. Dude, chill, all right? <laughs> Yo, Zuntir, you gotta chill, man. You're freaking out everyone in the fucking colony. You're acting weird, man. I don't think I'm cut out for this. Dude, chill! It's just Shago Gadash. Shago Gadash, arise. Shago Gadash. Arise! Shago Gadash! Arise! Arise! She does not feel the slightest need to reciprocate favors that others do for her, no matter how major the help was or how much she needed it. She only rarely tries to assert herself in conversation. She lives at a slow going and leisurely pace. She's generally unhindered by the thoughts of others concerning her actions. She's moved by art and natural beauty. And she is troubled by this, since she dislikes the natural world. <laughs> she sometimes acts with a little determination and confidence. She has a tendency toward forming deep emotional bonds with others. She prefers to present herself modestly. She generally finds herself quite hopeful about the future. She doesn't seek out excitement. She often feels envious of others. She generally acts with a narrow focus on the current activity. She needs alcohol to get through the working day. She likes working outdoors and grumbles only mildly at inclement weather. Okay. Well, she's dreaming of creating a great work of art, so hopefully that's about to happen. And they'll, like, uh, like, fulfill their duty and therefore be able to die. That'd be cool. There. 
They're making something. They're creating something incredible. People are walking by them, staring at them, and then running away. Troll update escaped. Gone. The game's saving. The season's changed. Any minute now. Any minute now. Shako Gidash. Shako Gidash. Shako Gidash. They created Shago Gidash. A golden ring. Yo, throw that out. <laughs> throw that out. I don't want it. Throw that out. Get that out of the house. Now take that outside. Well, before we take it outside, let's see. Holy shit! $5,000? The table sucked. It's mine. It's all mine. This is a gold ring. All cra crafts worship is of the highest quality. It is encrusted with cushion gabbro cabochons. This object menaces with spikes of gold and pig bone. Damn, man. Where you gonna take that? Where you gonna take that? You got no job anymore, man. Wait. They didn't even get good at it. They made one really high quality thing and then they were like, and I'm done. Possession is the bad kind of mood. Oh. Oh. I need to finish my office for the bookkeeper. I've got more important things to do than concern myself. With this bullshit. Chair. Done. Table. Done. Can we get someone to make a display case? Dude, I just wanted to type in the fucking box and it wouldn't let me. Why? Display case. Can we get someone to make one display case so I can store this ring somewhere safe? Now? Where's that ring at? Don't no one touch it. Better not be wearing it. Suntier, I swear to God, you wear that thing, I'll kill you. That's going in. That's going in the case. That's my property now. All right. You don't touch that thing. It's mine. All right, office. This here's an office for uh, everyone's favorite dwarf, the uh, bookkeeper. Yep. Oh, I need to check my crops. Because I'm pretty sure a bunch of this stuff doesn't even plant during these fucking periods. Uh, sweet pods. I'm just gonna plant a bunch of sweet pods. Yep. For now. Wow, we know exactly how much food and drink we have now. That's nice. When are we going to get more migrants, man? I've been waiting for the migrant hordes to arrive. Nothing else matters to me. No one wants to join the gorilla milkers. We haven't milked any. So how would they know that? Elk birds? Man, the underground is fucking weird, man. I don't know. It's uh, an elk with its giant elk looking fucking thing. I mean, I'm, I'm not going in there, so I don't really care. Let them live their life. Whole load of not my problem.
Anyone gonna finish that uh, display case? Anyone gonna get that made one of these days so I can get that ring somewhere cool? Can't make it, needs window. Oh yeah. How pray tell what I make that? Let me guess. With some kind of fucking glass furnace. Now, what's that going to take out of me? How quickly did they cancel that? Need sand bearing item. Can you be a little bit better at the description on that one? You know what I mean? Could be, uh... Need bag. <laughs> Come on, dude. Need a bag, dude! I'd like a bag, a couple bags, maybe. Get done. We'll see how that goes for me in a couple minutes. Finish the bag. Make bag. Is there even sand on the map? Ah. Uh, someone else's problem. Someone else's problem. Not gonna worry about it. Who else has become a bookkeeper? Because I'm pretty sure I only had one bookkeeper. So why did I just see a second bookkeeper get made? Dude, this kid needs to grow up. I'm getting so sick of them. I should have had them thrown into the hole. I really should have. It's just like... Come on. How much alcohol do you... Like, they just don't... They just drink alcohol all day. So what is a cloth bag? How do I make that? Hmm, let's see here. Let me take some wild guesses. Let me guess. Clothing and leather. Gonna need some kind of loom. Oh! Clothes! There it is. We're just gonna put that down right there. Yeah, I figured it out. How about you just go ahead and finish that? And now if someone here could make a cloth bag, that'd be really good. Cool, 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 cool. And once that bag is done, no one can stop me from making glass. You can always just buy stuff from caravans. Oh, thanks. Oh. Oh, good. Ah. <laughs> Yeah, last time I tried to buy stuff from a caravan, they wanted me to actually pay them well for their uh, their process, despite the fact that I knew exactly how much they were ripping me off, and then they said they wouldn't trade with me anymore until next year, which I think is a lot of bullshit, to be frank. Finish the glass. Need sand-bearing item. So the next thing I'd need to do is tell someone to get sand. I'm looking around at my base, not seeing much sand. If I go down to like, I don't know, mushroom level. Not seeing a lot of sand, I'm seeing a lot of mud. Let's go down to the level with the creatures. Oh. 
Mm, wow, we aren't even grabbing all this. Probably because this place is still set to the burrow, huh? Should probably just pause it. No, they are paused. Is anyone going to come down here and get all this gold? Sam. Hey, man. Well, hey, Chad. I don't know where to get that there, Sam. So it looks like we're not getting that display cabinet for the horrible ring that person made while possessed by a ghost. But hey, at the end of the day, does it really matter? I don't even know who really made it anymore. I can't remember. And simultaneously, uh, they probably ate it. I don't know where the ring is. They're not wearing it. They're not wearing it. So I don't know what it must be in one of these. No, that's just all the horse items. Can I get a uh, update on where this fucking ring is now? It's in this bin. Yeah, it's in a bin. It's in a bin somewhere. It's just in a bin. It's in a bin. I don't know uh, which one. It's in a bin. Well, hey. You know, could be worse. Could be worse. I feel like I need wood. Oh, God, we need wood. Time to deforest. Chewing. Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't want to do it over spots where stuff can, like, collapse anymore. That's just not something I'm interested in. Here is okay, though. Put that shit down. I just... Chat, where am I gonna find sand? Chat, where the hell am I gonna freaking find sand, man? And we're running out of drinks again. I don't even think people are doing the brewing thing. Go to the beach. Embark to find sand. I am not doing that. There's no fucking way I'm leaving. All right, I didn't do that shit in RimWorld. I'm not doing it now. I never leave my base. Okay, that's one thing I don't do. Creatures want to get me, they can come to me. All right, they can come try to get me. All right? Matter of fact, I think it's time to start escalating on that exact concept. Chat. Yep. I think it's just about time we take a look very carefully at uh, some kind of longer form operation where we sort of make a RimWorld style coil to allow creatures in safely entering a kind of kill hall where they get ripped to shreds. Mm-hmm. Because God knows my dwarves don't know how to get clothes on to be in, an, in like an army. This might be the best bet. Hand. Might be worth it. Hog. There's a pack of hogs wandering towards my house. Oh, look at them. Hello. Four to five wild hogs. Oh, they're scattering. Wow, they're scared of us. But are they scared of Uvash, the two-year-old? The dabbling milker and planter who likes rainbows. I'm glad they're having fun out there. You know what? I reckon it's about time we secure the surface, chat. I think that's the next step. Yep. About 
damn, we secure some kind of, some kind of battlements. I truly don't know what any of this walls get. It's kind of important that it's not like fucking wood though, huh? Kind of just can't let it do it like that. Okay, they're just doing it. It's all wood. Of course it's all wood. God fucking damn it, guys. I wanted to cancel it. <laughs> I wanted it canceled. You won't even let me deconstruct it now. Oh my god, I hate them. I hate them. Oh, it just wasn't updating. Get it all out of here. Take that shit back down. All right, a little too fast on the draw, guys. I could, I can't believe I'm saying I'm I'm gonna complain about that, but I'm complaining about it too fast on the draw. Next time, ask maybe maybe next time ask the foreman before you just start running for it. Because I wanted I obviously wanted this shit made out of gabbro. I mean sandstone. And, I, and more sandstone. And more sandstone. Obviously, sandstone is one of the most powerful of the metals. Yes. We never leave anymore. Wait, but then how will I take shit to the dump? Wait. Do we finally- oh my god. There's so much stuff in that. Do we finally breach the pile? No one would dare approach our fucking awful looking base. Not a million years. This is the most secured base we could possibly create now. Gonna put a ramp right there. Gonna make it out of Gabbro blocks. Yes. Now we can get easily up to the second floor. You locked yourself out, you fucking idiot, Uvash. God damn it, Uvash! Fuck you! Are you kidding me? Ah! Hope it was worth it, you stupid idiot. Let's hope it was worth it. It's fine, I wanted to make like a drawbridge or something. It's fine, I just don't really care. It's fine. I'm not I'm not upset. I was gonna make like a bridge. I was gonna carve this out, these two. I was gonna make a bridge. And I wanted to like dig a big old ditch. And fill it with like water. Okay, well, look, now I have to get rid of this. Now I fucking have to get rid of it. These two parts. While that's happening. While that's happening, I would like flooring installed. Out of. Do I still have sandstone? Oh God, we're gonna run out. Ah, uh, fuck. I've been holding off on digging out more sandstone, but we do need it. And I can always just build walls when I need it. So let's grab some of it. Wow, we got a lot of coke. <laughs> Lots of coke. Holy heck. Damn. Did we ever grab all that, uh, ore? Does anyone want to fucking bring the- oh, there he is. 
You know what I think it is, chat? You know what I think is the real problem? And I'm starting to realize we need more wheelbarrows. We need more freaking wheelbarrows. There's not enough wheelbarrows for all the stuff people are traveling with. If we make a couple more wheelbarrows, people are actually going to use them. That's what the problem's been. Oh, yeah, dude. That's what the freaking problem's been. That's what I'm telling you. Yep. It all makes perfect sense now. Make some floors there. We're just securing this place so when the apocalypse happens, when the horrible creatures come to kill us, we'll be ready. We need this place absolutely ready for anything. For when the dragon comes. And they will. When the dragon comes to kill us. They're not gonna kill me. Ready? Sure. You'll see. You'll fucking see, man. This place is gonna be, like, so archer ready. Like, archers are just gonna rip these fucking... Anyone comes after me after this? End of the line, dude. Did I make walls instead of floors? I love that this shit doesn't, like, actually work when you do, like, this part and you tell it to not build things. And none of it updates ever. I hate you. Deconstruct all this shit. Deconstruct all this shit. No. Get rid of it. There. Now build floors. <laughs> Out of sandstone. Not walls. Floors. Just floors. There. There it is, dude. There it is. Secure. Problem is, there's just this patch of grass in the middle that I can't really ever fix without ripping up the uh, hatches and stairs. Damn shame. Get rid of all these things. How do I get rid of boulders? Jet. Or are they just like a uh, fucking, you gotta smooth them. I have to, you're telling me we can't just break boulders and move them. We have to smooth them down to be, to be normal small rocks. All right, you're right. When you're right, you're right, man. I think I'm actually going to dismantle this and move it. The Trade Depot. We are going to make a moat. And by a moat, I mean a ditch. Yes. So, if I build a ramp, well, we can't ramp because there's a level beneath us. We can't do that. <laughs> we can't be idiots like that. That's, that's farming sector. Okay, so we're just going to live like this. But what I am going to do is build spike pits. I'm going to put spikes all over this fucking place. No one comes in here. 
We're gonna put doors down. We're gonna put spikes down. All right, I'm not playing. Weapon traps use a weapon or trap component to strike intruders. Okay, well, all this... We'll just... Look, we're just gonna do this safely. We're just gonna be smart. Just having some extra battlements, I think, is nice. Put some doors down. I do have schemes, though. I have no doors. <laughs> I have schemes, but I have no doors. No, not wooden door. Make a couple, uh... Couple rock doors, please. I'll tell you what, though. Base definitely came together a lot faster than the uh, last one. That's for sure. Definitely came together much faster. Tell us all this. Mind that. Mind those crystals. Nice, nice. I'll definitely say, like, as far as, like, ooh, more copper from me. I love copper, even though no one in my base will use it. There's definitely a part of me that's, like, I will still need to spend, like, another fucking, like, evening on my own playing to, like, figure out what the fuck's going on with, like, the squad and shit like that because, like, I just can't get instructed by chat on something like that. It's too much. It's just too much. But at least the base now, wor like, works. It's better than the last one. We have, like, actually, like, renewable food. These doors are going to be different doors from one another. I was waiting for another pack of guys to show up. Get ready. These doors are going to be really ugly. They're going to be totally different colors. Okay, well. Wait a minute. Idea. What's stopping me? First of all, I've had enough of this kid going outside. Pissing me off. We're gonna get killed. And that's gonna really bum out a lot of the team. <laughs> I'm not, I'm, I'm worried about that kid. Wow, what a mighty fort. It's a square. It's fucked. That's fucked up, man. That's actually like fucked up. It's cold. Oh, migrants, migrants. My if it was just a square, you know, we wouldn't be getting this brand new fucking pack of migrants coming in. Where are they? Population hasn't changed. Where are they? D are you telling me none? A migrant swarm of none? Migrants? You think maybe it's because I got rid of the the wagon? Are they afraid of gilk? Gorilla milk? <laughs> I'm I'm upset. I'm upset right now. I've been really banking on the, those new recruits, dude. What the fuck? No! Huh? Huh? Plump helmet man! A 
a small humanoid resembling a walking mushroom with arms and legs. It lives far underground near water and soil. He's just a mushroom boy. So I guess I'm really not getting any migrants. I mean, I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm cool. That doesn't bother me. I'm definitely not mad about that. That I got teased by them telling me that there was migrants coming and then none came. If migrants didn't show up, danger or siege is nearby threat. What did you just say to me? Is this a swarm of vicious Kias? They're terrified of something. What? Of what? What are they terrified of? The trolls? Are there... Are there trolls back? <gasps> oh, wait, no, that troll's in the basement. Well, no one knows about that. Hey, don't come near the fucking door, though, asshole. Why does nobody like me? Why, why does nobody like me, though? Why? Maybe it's all the bones? The bones are the best part of the entire place. I'm so conf- Man, I was really banking on people coming. That's sad. Maybe I'm getting raided. Maybe I'm about to get killed. <laughs> Not like anyone would dare try what with how powerful I am. Because of your aspirations for Gilk. Motherfucker. There is literally no gorillas in this game. I think that mod edited out gorillas. Truly, I think it edited out the gorillas. I haven't seen one. And that's damn sad. Ready up the wheelbarrows we're gonna need them. What are you talking about? The fuck does that mean? Is that a threat? There's too much coke! We've been making coke for too long! We made a big fucking mistake with the coke! We fucked up on that! Expand the stockpile. Barrows just full of gilk. Chat, stop. You're the reason they hated us. You're the reason, not me, not high. Ye, ye are the reason that the people hate us. Thine. Find other reason. Damn, man. Well, hey. Next time we play, if I so deem it worth playing again, then we shall find out what happened to those fools because I'm probably going to do some genuine... We're not doing another reset, but I do have to go. It's been five hours. I'm done. I got to stream again tomorrow and then I stream again the next day. I got stuff going on. I'll go ahead and save with my iconic... Right on. But yeah, good times. That time we actually, like, got stuff done. And had, like, an actual base that works. I need to figure out what's going on with the weird squad. But, uh, this was good time. This was good time. Good time, good time, good time. Alright. I will catch you all next time.
It's been a pleasure. It really has. I need to go find food. If you give the subs, donate bits, etc. Thanks. I appreciate it. I'll be back on Thursday at the usual time. Uh, we'll be streaming. I would. It's unlikely it would be more of this just yet. I would say what's more likely is that we're going to play the long dark tomorrow. Uh, because there's been a expansion to that game that's also overhauled some stuff. The expansion's not fully done, but it's added some content. It's overhauled some stuff, and I'm kind of interested in checking it out. So maybe doing that tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, we'll see. We'll see. No guarantees on anything. Aside from that, I will be streaming something. Either way, I will catch you all then, 3 p.m. ish EST as usual. See ya.